All right, honey, go check in. Like, by myself? You're 16 years old. You still need me to do everything for you? Uh, yes. Please, Mom, like, I can't do it. Can you, like, please do it for me? Jesus, you need to grow up a little. Oh, uh, yeah, maybe, like, next year. Hi, yeah, I'm here to check my daughter in for her physical. Uh, she has a 10-15 with Dr. Yumbles. Ma'am, it is 10-35. I'll have to see if Dr. Yumbles can still see her today. Do you know how hard it is to get your children up and dressed and out of the house on time? I went 105 down I-90, risking a speed and ticket, and I didn't even get my morning coffee yet. You and I both know we're gonna be sitting here for an hour and a half before we even get seen by the nurse. Now you tell Dr. Youngboss that we waited eight months for this physical and we ain't rescheduling. I'll see what I can do. What's the child's name? Emma Whitlock. Hi, sweetie. It's not your fault, mommy's a bitch. I love your little pigtails. I think we can make time for her. Pigtails? Uh, no, my daughter is 16. She's over there. So can they see her or not? Your copay will be $45. 40, Jesus, what's the point in having health insurance? Just bill me. You have too many bills that have gone to your house that have gone unpaid. Yeah, that'll fall off in like seven years. Payment will be required up front for today's appointment. Of course it is. That lady was a bitch. It's not okay if we're 20 minutes late, but it's okay if they make you wait two hours to get seen, right? Two hours later. Emma? Oh, actually, Mom, we prefer if the older teenagers get seen on their own for privacy reasons. No, she wants me here. Trust me, it's fine. Let's go. Well, it's just... I carried her for nine months in my body and then pushed her out of my hoo-ha. And you want to talk about privacy? Yeah, okay. Okay, just right in here. All right, I'm just gonna have you fill out this form and the doctor will be in very shortly. Um, okay. Yeah, just put in all zeros. It's just to see if you have depression. Um, like based on these questions, I think I like might. You can be depressed at home, but you don't want the doctors to know you're depressed because then they're gonna label you as depressed and put that in your file. And then everywhere you go, you're gonna be known as a depressed girl. And then any illness you might ever have, they're gonna blame it on depression. Yeah, like I don't want them to do that. Hello, I'm Dr. Youngballs. How are we doing today? Mom, I see you're joining us this morning. Yeah, you know what? I did give birth to her. Don't you think mom should know what's going on with her daughter? Hello again, Emma. Hi. Good to see you're growing well. Some places more than others. I'll take that. I'm here. Oh, there it is. Well, aren't you just a happy camper? You're lucky. Almost everyone these days has depression. Yeah, not me. I, I like them like super happy. I like love life. It's like so, it's so fun. Yeah, she's a very happy girl. I wish I could have some of whatever you're taking. Oh, I can like give you this number. <clears throat> I mean like my number is like 16. I'm like, I'm 16. I can see that. And have you had your first menstrual cycle yet? Oh, she got that when she was nine. Come on, look at us. She's clearly grown into her body. And are your cycles pretty regular? Yeah, they're regular. All right, now just a few questions for Emma. What am I here for then? Thanks for getting me out of the mental hospital. People started hitting on me. I just had to clarify that you're not schizophrenic. Lots of other problems that probably do want to visit, but not schizophrenia. I love that you're so honest. Are you nervous? A little. Wait, about what? It's our first day back to school after hard launching our relationship on Instagram. Suddenly the hospital isn't sounding so bad. Thanks a lot. I just mean that we're gonna have to deal with the wrath of Casey, knowing that she's literally been in love with you and now I'm dating you and I'm her best friend. Or was probably. Casey doesn't own me. Yeah, cause I do. N no. Where did you get that? Not into that. Got it. Get some horse wings and maybe we'll talk. That's a new one. But I'll try anything. Literally, I've slept with almost everyone at this school. <laughs> Except the teachers. No. Now that we're in a relationship, I think we should just keep our past private. Okay. 
Um, let's also make a visit to the clinic soon. Why? I don't need birth control now. Unless... No, 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 I don't. I meant, I meant to get you some blood testing and swapped. Oh, my chlamydia cleared up. It, it's good now. What now? The coming. Seemed like I said something funny. Say is funny. God, Taylor, you're impossible. Come here. Oh. oh, do it again. It's getting crazy over here. Yeah, me and Taylor were making out. I don't know if you saw. I did. I I also saw her slap you. Yeah, we like it rough. I'm into that. Literally, never do that again. That was disgusting. Yeah, she also likes to degrade me, make me feel bad. It's hot. No, it's not. Nothing about that was hot. See? She's really good at it. Me and JJ are dating. Yeah, I saw. You told Instagram. Before you told your best friend. Who you've known since you were two. Well, technically, she told me first. We pooped in our diapers together. I pulled Skittles out of your cooch when you took Taste the Rainbow a little too seriously. I can't see I'm surprised. I don't know. I just thought maybe, you know, Zoe, the emotionally unavailable whore, actually liking someone enough to want to date them might be something worth telling your best friend. But I guess not. That's just the way it is these days. Nothing makes sense in the world anymore. JJ was the nerdiest girl in school and is now one of the most popular and dating someone that has never even liked anyone long enough to even have sex with them for a second time. And I, the hottest, coolest girl in school, can't even get the nerd to like me. And Mrs. Axman and the janitor are getting more action than me. Nothing is right in the world. I thought she was just gonna be really mean about it. She's crying. I didn't think that was possible. I've literally never seen her cry. She didn't even cry when her dad left to go get milk and never came back. Or when her mom got her all excited that she was gonna have a little sister and then hoarded it. Hey, hey. What are we doing? It's my way, you know. Not part of it. How? JJ, kiss her. No. I don't want JJ to kiss me. I don't want sympathy sex. No one's said anything about sex. She's still a virgin, and that's gonna happen with me. Okay, I probably deserve that. Go ahead. Tell me how you really feel. Can I take a second? Casey, I know you have a huge crush on me, but against all odds, for some reason, I, I like Joey. Ew, you wish. What? As if I'd ever date you. There she is. How pathetic is it that you have to make up that I like you, knowing that I'd never go for you, so you have to settle for the uglier and dumber version of me? I feel like I'm being that short. Welcome back. Come on, Taylor, my beautiful girlfriend. Walk me to class. Now. Taylor! I'm literally only going along with this because I don't want to be a bystander to whatever lesbian stuff is about to happen, so... I don't have to be a bystander. Coming, darling. Come on, I'll walk you to class. JJ, why are you not up? It is time to go to school. I'm sick, I can't go. You're fine. Look, see, I have a fever. Get up, now. No, oh, Dad, please, I really don't feel good. Suck it up. You're being a crybaby. I'm not a crybaby. I'm just sick.
Susan. I'm so happy I put alcohol in my coffee this morning. Mommy! Hang on, Susan. What's going on in here? She doesn't want to go to school because she's sick. I think I'm dying. JJ, honey, are you actually sick or are you faking it? I think I can see the light. Yeah, hold on. JJ. JJ. Sorry, what happened? I'm the wheeliest and I'm hallucinating. Maybe we should just let her stay home. Oh no, my tummy hurts now. I think I'm gonna have diarrhea. You couldn't have just used a condom, Bobby? Like one time? Oh no, Bobby, I think I pooped myself. God damn it. I I'm gonna be like 10 minutes later. No, please, Dad. Please, I can't go. Please. Honey, one day isn't going to hurt. Mm -hmm. It starts with one day, and then the next day, she'll be smoking weed in the back of Marky Adams' van. Fast forward a few years and she's dropped out of high school and she's working at the gentleman's club down the street. And then I'll have to stop going there and I am not willing to take that risk. I'm done with this. JJ, you can stay home today, but you're going to school tomorrow, okay? Will we? I mean... <coughs> Thank you, Mom. I love you. Okay. My immune system thanks you. I'm watching you. <coughs> Suckers. If I want to be a stripper, I'll be a stripper. Fuck you, Dad. I'm so cold. Oh, when did we move to Antarctica? <coughs> Fucking annoying. I just want to play my video game in peace. Why doesn't he understand that? Wow, my horsey just learned a new jump. What was that? Oh my god, is that your emergency alert? Did you not hear me ringing the doorbell? What? It's pretty cold out there and I'm wearing shorts. Oh my god, is that what that thing is? Nobody has ever pressed that. Why didn't you just text me that you were here? Oh, I don't really do this often. I don't really know the protocol. Sorry. Okay, well come in. So, did you get the stuff? Oh, I got the stuff. Oh my god, yay. I'm so excited. I've never carved pumpkins before. Oh, because you've never had any friends to carve them with? No. I, I mean, yeah, I guess, but I meant because my parents never bought them for us. That's sad. What did you guys do for fall activities then? Um, I waked the leaves. Oh, to stuff them into dummies for Halloween? No, my parents just made me wake the leaves so there wouldn't be leaves. Here, you can have the big one since you're so experienced. Damn, you're like really strong, huh? Yeah, I work out sometimes. Oh, oh my god, no. You have to take the top off first and scoop out the guts. Oh, sorry. It's okay. Here, let me show you. Hmm. You really seem like you know what you're doing. Okay, ready? Ta -da! Okay. Wow, this hole is almost as big as mine. Okay, here, you try now. Okay. I already have one right here, but, but thanks. This is a lot harder than it looks. That's what she said. Um, can you help me? Is this just an excuse to get me to be romantic? I don't know. Is it working? Yeah. Here. Oh, hey, Dad. I didn't know you were going to be home so early. Who's this? Hi, I'm JJ. I'm the da oh. dating expert. She's, she's the dating expert. What? Uh, yes, I am a dating expert. I have so much experience in dating that they call me an expert. I I'm here for coaching. Good. I'm happy you finally took my advice. Oh, what, was it your idea to hire me? Yes, my daughter is a little bit of a whore, and she's a little bit too proud of it. Okay, no kidding. Well, sir, you can count on me. And is there some kind of learning experience in carving pumpkins? Uh, yes. It, it teaches the overactive brain and body to slow down and focus on a singular task instead of jumping from one thing to another, or in Zoe's case, one person to another. Carry on, then.
I'll be in my office. Bye, Daddy. Oh, and Zoe, have that wrapped up before six. I have a business meeting here tonight. Okay. Who does business meetings at night? Um, we can't stay here past six, okay? Why? This is kind of sus. Um, it is. My dad is kind of involved in some sketchy shit. Wait, for real? Like what? Let's finish carving the pumpkins. Okay. Okay, so now we pull all the guts out. You're concerningly good at pulling guts out. <laughs> You're funny. I have a business meeting here tonight. My dad is kind of involved in some sketchy shit. We can't stay here present. So now we pull all the guts out. Okay. Now we just carve a face. Do you enjoy carving faces? JJ, what are you talking about? You sound crazy. It was a joke. You look cute carving pumpkins. So, why didn't you want your dad to know that we're on a date? Um, my brother was gay. What brother? Exactly. He killed him? What? No! He just kicked him out. God damn, who do you think we are? Oh, what a relief. So, is is that why you're straight? I don't know. I don't like labels. Or, I guess it just doesn't really matter because I'll never be able to be anything but straight. I'm sorry. You can't look yet. It's a surprise. Mine's a surprise, too. Okay, I'm done. One, One two, two, three. It's you. I did you, too. Oh, you did me? Aw, you made me look so pretty. You are pretty. This is supposed to be your ponytail. What's that? Oh, nothing. I, I just messed up. Um, it looks like letters. No, really, I, I was just practicing. JJ, show me. No. Show me. No. Why did you do that? I, I, I don't know. Hey, what is going on in here? Who did this? I did. Are you kidding me? What is wrong with you? You're an idiot. I'm sick of your shit. This is not your house, and you shouldn't be treating it like it is. I'm sorry, Daddy. She needs to leave. Okay, Daddy. I'll walk her out. I'm Willie Solway. It's okay. I like you because you're weird and spontaneous. I never know what to expect with you. Okay, well, I'll see you at school. Bye. Okay, bye. Wait, I don't have a wide. Why are you so freaking slow? Game over. Ah. Oh, okay, okay. Wow, yep. this is so yep. much fun. Yeah, yep. yep. wow, yep. this is great. Yep. Yep. Wow. Yep. Yep. Uh -huh. Is Daddy having a play date with someone? You have to call me Grandpa if you want me to pay for your next boob job. Call me Grandpa. Can I just call you Hillary Clinton instead? No, call me Grandpa. Okay, Grandpa. Grandpa. Oh, I'm just a little bitch old man. Do you think we should go investigate? You're a little bitch, Grandpa. I agree. Did you wet your pants? Do you need me to put a diaper on you? Okay. Tell yourself that you're worthless. That doesn't sound like mommy. You're ugly. I'm ugly. You're stupid. I'm worthless. You're not even cute. I don't deserve you. More. How do you like that, Grandpa? More. That's definitely not mommy. The only thing good about you is your money. Yeah. I'm not gonna well, steal for this shit. I love this. Yeah, dirty grandpa. Dirty grandpa. Mommy, where are you? What's wrong, JJ? I'm at hot yoga right now. Well, I think daddy is having a play date with someone else. What? He keeps repeating, call me grandpa, call me grandpa. I think he's playing house with someone. Why are you not playing house with them? Oh, that fucking piece of shit. Is this a bad time to tell you to fail my math test? Karen, is everything okay? Yeah, everything's fine. Okay, whenever you're ready, just join us in Downward Dog. Okay. Okay, Who's now that? you can call me Hillary Clinton. JJ, I need you to go to the fridge and read me the phone number. Okay. Okay, Hillary. Yes, Hillary Clinton. Okay, yeah, I see them. Which one? There's two. The bottom one. One, tweet, tweet, tweet. Four, 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 six, nine, six, nine. Okay, thanks, honey. I'll be home soon. I love you, Hillary Clinton. I love you. What the frick? Ow, oh, hi, cow. What is going on? Why is Mrs. Smith here? Uh, well, um, why are you having a play date with my ex-girlfriend's mom and not my mom? 
Sometimes grown-ups like to have playdates with more than one person. Honey, sometimes the person you're playing games with just wants to play the same game over and over again. Right. And it gets kind of boring, so you want to play a new game with a new person. Something's fishy. So how's school going? No, wait a minute. It smells like tuna in here. Mm-hmm. Are you going to get a divorce? <gasps> I can see how this is a little awkward for you, hon. Why don't I take you to my plastic surgeon to make you feel better? He made me feel better. You're not taking my daughter to get a boob job. I don't want bigger boobs. Well, honey, now you just sound crazy. She's a kid. I like to look at them, but I don't want to have them. I mean, who doesn't want bigger boobs? I want someone to love me for my personality and intellect, not my boobies. Well, I don't have either of those, so... She really doesn't. But I do have a bleached asshole. What? You, you do have that, yeah. <laughs> Dad, why are you crying? Because your mother doesn't love me anymore, and the best I can get is this idiot. Oh, my God. I just won front row tickets to Lady Gaga for Friday night. <laughs> Do you guys want to come? No. Why does he want my social security number? Do you see what I mean? Yeah, she's a real winner. I'm going to call them. <laughs> Pull yourself together, Bobby. Don't let your daughter see you cry. I'm already watching. Hi. You said I won the tickets? Dad, I'm really disappointed in you. Yeah, how many do I get? JJ, honey, please can we just keep this between us? No. JJ, don't do that to me. I need my boob job money. I'll buy you Horse Adventures 3. Really? Mm-hmm. You just cannot tell mommy about this, okay? Okay. Here's my card. Remember, just secret. Thanks. Hey, Mom. They're in there. Are you f***ing kidding me? Hi. How are you? Oh, uh, hey, honey. Uh, what's up, sweetie? Is that our daughter's ex-girlfriend's mother? What is wrong with you? Oh, my God. I did that to him, too, before you got here. Oh, you like that? Oh. Oh, oh yeah. Now we're spicing it up. You're really cheating on me with this bimbo? No. I am not a bimbo. Okay, I definitely am, but why is that a bad thing? It's not. Don't let her get to you. I love you, honey. I am very, very sorry. I've done nothing but be a supportive and loving wife for you, and this is how you repay me? I'm sorry. Uh, hey, honey, while you're over there, would you mind passing me my coffee? This coffee? You want this? Oh, yeah. Sure. Of course. Okay. That works, too. Okay, I think it might be time for me to leave. This is starting to get a bit awkward. Please don't leave me alone with her. Oh, really? You don't want to stay for dinner, too? I think this might be family business, so. Yeah. Yeah, it is. And you know what else is family business? What? Fucking my husband. Right. Okay, well, um, I just remembered that I have a four o'clock to get my asshole rebleached, so. I'm gonna go. Yeah. Okay. I'm not gonna do this anymore. What do I need to do to get you to want me and only me? Dye my hair blonde? Get a boob job? Bleach my fucking asshole? Yeah. That would, that would be great, actually. That's it. I'm calling the divorce lawyer that I should have called a year ago. And in the meantime, you can find somewhere else to sleep. What? You want to you wanna divorce me? No, please. Please, I promise I'll do better. What if, what if I only have one side chick from now on? You have more than one? I have eight. Get out of the house. Can I at least grab my Playboy magazine? No, okay, I'll go. Okay, class, I need everyone to pick a lab partner that they want to work with for the next month. This is my chance to get close to Emma. I have so many split ends. You can do it. The worst you can say is no. I need a manicure. Okay, I'm gonna do it. Here I go. No, I can't. What if she rejects me? I'll never recover. No, stop being a loser. Okay, on a count of three. One, two, two and a half. Hey, I'm Nova. Wow, that's a pretty name. Thanks. You're pretty. And Emma. Well, Emma, would you like to make some chemistry with me? Yeah. Sit down. Okay. Hey, JJ, do you want to be my- No, get away from me. Okay. I'm going to be honest. I'm not that skilled at chemistry but I am pretty educated in the anatomy department. You're so funny. Sorry about Emma. I know you really like her. It's fine. Well, I know I'm not your first choice and maybe not even your second, but do you want to be my partner? Yeah, sure. 
for the record. I think Emma is dumb for not wanting to be with you. Really? Yeah, what's well, not to love? You're funny, smart, caring, and really beautiful. Thanks, Carlos. That's really sweet. Okay, everyone grab the beaker in front of you. We're gonna start the lesson. Sorry, sorry. I didn't mean to. <laughs> it's okay. Okay, everyone grab the beaker in front of you. We're gonna start the lesson. Sorry, sorry. I didn't mean to. <laughs> it's okay. Your hands are really smooth. Thanks. I use intensive hand cream. Cool. Do you want some? Uh... Yeah, yeah. I got you. Open your hand. Okay. Here you go. Thanks. Are you okay? Mm -hmm. I have no idea what I'm doing. Do I need to take a shower? Oh, yes, definitely. No! Are you kidding me? Who's in there? Me. Well, are you almost done? I need to take a shower. No, I'm shaving my entire body. Mia, please. I have a date and I smell bad. Who on earth would want to date you? Can you stop being a jerk and just hurry up and shave faster? Yeah, fine. Give me two minutes. Actually. What? I thought you were gay, honey. Yeah, me too. All that counseling on how to raise a gay daughter was for nothing? Mia is gay. No, she has a boyfriend. Uh, no, she's just a masculine lesbian. Oh. Finally. There's no hot water left. I hate you. It's gonna be so cold. <laughs> <laughs> This is about to be the fastest shower of my life. Can I put my nails? Oh no, it's a boy. <laughs> oh, quick. Hello? Hey, I'm on the way. Have you left yet? Yep, I'm in the car. I'll be here soon, okay? Love you, bye. What? I don't have time. I shave my coach. You never know. Okay. Okay, what the foot do I wear? There's too many options and none that I like. Well, it's gonna be a movie theater, so it's probably gonna be cold. But if he puts his arm around me, I'm probably gonna get hot. Why does this have to be so difficult? No, 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 no. It's all wrong. It's all wrong. Wait. This is perfect. Okay, I think this is good. This is cute. <laughs> what if he tries to kiss me? What if my breath stinks? What if it tastes like garlic? I haven't even eaten garlic. No. It burns, it burns. No. It's not good enough. I don't want to be known as the girl with bad breath. Everywhere, just everywhere. It should be 
Okay, I'm wedding. No, I'm not wedding. I can't do this. I'm too nervous. What if I'm a bad kisser? What if he's a bad kisser? I'm being dramatic. It's just a movie. It's just a freaking movie. No, it's not. It's never just a movie. Carlos. Hey, JJ. You look really beautiful. Thanks. I just got this new short. I mean, I actually got in a dumpster behind our apartment complex, but it's new to me. It's pretty, but it's not as pretty as you. Thanks. You smell good. He doesn't, but I can't tell him that. Did he even put on deodorant? You too. Damn, I didn't even put on deodorant. She must just like my natural pheromones. Nice. So, what movie are we seeing? Doesn't matter. What do you mean? Well, are we even gonna be watching the movie? Oh, what? Does he really want to kiss me for two hours straight? I guess not. Well, I was thinking a romance movie. Maybe like... On True Love's doorstep? Um, actually, I was thinking The Brick House at the end of the street. What's that, comedy? Horror. Oh. I can't even watch Harry Potter without having nightmares, but I don't want to look like a wimp. Yeah, that, that sounds great. Okay. I already bought my ticket online. Uh, oh. I, I was gonna pay for you. I don't believe in old-fashioned etiquette or social norms. I can take care of myself, and I definitely do not belong in the kitchen. Oh. Uh, okay. okay. Uh, wait, but how, how did you know what movie we were gonna see? You just asked me. I didn't. So, I bought tickets to all of them. I like to be prepared. Okay. Um, I'm just gonna go buy mine then. Okay. Hey dude, can I get one ticket to the brick house at the end of the street? Bruh, that's rated R, bruh. Do you have your ID? No. Mike, I'm literally in your class, bro. You know I'm not of age. Just give me the ticket. Alright, I honestly really don't care. But just so you know, that movie's fucking scary, bruh. Are you for real? Yeah, bro, I cried for three days and had to sleep on the floor in my parents' room. Fuck. Oh, well, you don't want to look like a pussy in front of your girl. I know, bro. Hey, bro, do you have any weed on you? No. Damn, all right. Well, good luck, bro. You're gonna need it. All right, I got my ticket. You ready to go in? Wait, where are you going? In into the theater. Without popcorn? Uh, no, no, we can get popcorn. Dad, we need popcorn. That's the best part of the movie. Oh, good. The preview's just started. We have, like, 20 minutes to talk. I kind of wanted to watch the previews. Yeah, okay. Oh, wait, let me get out candy. Hold this, please. m ms Notes. Winsy's Pieces. That's pretty impressive. Oh, here are your snow caps. Oh, the corn sponge bites. And... Hmm. I could have sworn I put a Snickers in here. Oh, I found it. <clears throat> here you go. Uh, oh, I think it's open. There's some, there's some chocolate on the wrapper. I don't think that's chocolate. The movie is starting. Can you see me? Hello? Can you find me? I'm here. This is so funny. What the fuck, bro? Why did she enjoy this? He hasn't tried to put his arm around me yet. <laughs> this movie is really good. <laughs> Why do I get the feeling that he's the one that needs to be comforted? Is this too scary for you? No. Here, have some popcorn. Okay. Just distract yourself. Ask her questions to get to know her. Oh my god. So, um, JJ, tell me, why do you, um, like horses so much? That's random. Um, I don't know. I've, I've just liked them ever since I was a little girl. I think they're pretty and majestic. Cool. You sh Carlos, look, those people are making out. Uh, I think they're doing more than that. 
Oh, what? don't people know there's camels in I'm here? I'm here, behind you, look. There are? Yeah, everywhere. Behind you. Hey, you should slow down on that icy. You're gonna have to pee during the movie. Don't tell me how to live. Okay. I really just don't want to be left alone here. Okay, it's been like an hour. You need to make a move already. Why are you being a pussy? Just do it. This is so funny. What if she's not into it though? Just make it look casual. Oh. Are you tired? There's still a lot of the movie left. Yeah, yeah, a little. This is the best movie I've ever seen. That was so weak. Oh, oh my god, did you see that? Maybe I should just ask her. Hey, um, can, can I put my armor on you? It's about time. Oh, I thought I was gonna have to put my armor on you. Ah, uh, this is nice. For like, I really have to pee. Wow, she's so into me that she's shaking. I feel like I'm gonna pee myself. Damn, I must be giving her butterflies. I don't wanna miss the movie though. Come on, dude, you're sexy, you got this. Just go in for the kiss. She is not getting the hint. <laughs> Maybe if I lick my lips. Why are you staring at me? You're gonna miss the movie. Okay. Oh, you're just jealous you're here alone. Why hasn't he asked to kiss me? Maybe he doesn't like me. <sighs> Why do I have to do everything? Hey, do you want to kiss me? Yes, Lily. <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah, come back. Uh, are you sure? Yeah, promise. Oh, uh, I don't. I don't think that pants candy is, is sitting too well. Jesus. S sorry. Are you for real, bruh? I told you this movie was too much for you. Well, fortunately, it's over anyway. Oh, um, I, I, got, I gotta go to the bathroom. Bruh. How you doing, champ? Better. Sorry about that. It's fine. Can you pull some of this stuff, though? Uh, yeah. You're never gonna go on another date with me, are you? No, of course I will. It's just a normal human bodily function. Plus, it's probably my fault for giving you candy out of my pants. Hold that thought. <laughs> well, good thing I had a bucket this time. Oh, um, uh, my dad's here. Yeah, my mom is too. I'll, um, text you later. Yeah. Maybe not. I think, I think you're gonna need some mouthwash. Right. That's fair. Maybe, maybe next time. Okay, bye. Bye. All right, the treadmill's always a good starter one. Well, I do love to run. Cool, yeah, me too. But like, first we should just start with a walk, just to, like get warmed up. Okay. Um, I think we're warmed up. All right, so for this one, you're just gonna sit right here and, oh shit, uh, let me increase the weight. That's way too light. Okay, you're just gonna grab it like this and pull it straight down and squeeze your sh shoulder blades together. Okay. 
Just like that. Just like this. Here, let me get it for you. All right, it's probably gonna be pretty difficult, so just go easy. And if you want me to lessen the weight, just like let me know, okay? Like this. Oh crap! Did I did I lessen the weight? Dang! Yeah, I I totally did. Let me uh, increase it for you. Oh, okay. All right, that should be a little more of a challenge for you. I don't feel much of a difference. You know what? I think this one's broken. Let's try a different one. Okay. All right, you might not be able to do this, but it's okay. Just try your best and don't get discouraged, right? All right. All right, I'm gonna do like 10 pull-ups and then you can just try one, okay? Sure. You got this, Carlos. It, it's, it's pretty hard because you have to like pull up your entire body weight. It seems pretty difficult. Okay, done. Your turn. That was only five. I thought you were doing ten. Did I say ten? I meant five. Mm -hmm. So I just hold on to this and pull myself up five times? Yeah, but honestly, I'll be impressed if you even do one, so don't worry. Okay. feel better. You're such a gentleman. Yeah, you, you caught me. Bro, that's pretty messed up for you to befriend a child at the gym, showing her how to work out. Fucking creepy, bro. First of all, little man, I'm not little. It's okay to be a short king. JJ is like a sister to me. I care about her more than my own family. Secondly, I have a hot man upstairs waiting for me to finish warming up my arms. So what? Oh. Carlos, don't be rude. Papa Bear is the only family that cares about me. My dad drops me off at the child care center at the gym every single night so he can have the house alone to have sex with his bimbo. And the child care center stops accepting children at age six. But my dad seems to have forgotten that I'm a teenager. And the child care people felt so bad for me that they gave me a free membership to the gym because they think I have a neglectful parent. Which I do. And Papa Bear is a tweener there and has so generously offered to twain me for free. Oh, I'm over this. Carlos, can we go? Yeah. I'm watching you, man. I know where you live. If you break her heart, I will break you. And you best believe that I can do that with one hand, little man. Carlos, you're sweating from your crotch. I think you may have pushed yourself too hard. Yeah. So this is my room. Wow. It's surprisingly clean. What's that supposed to mean? Nothing. I'm just kind of shocked. That I'm clean? Yeah. I, I swear I am. Look. Here's my test results if you don't believe me. What? No, that, that's okay. Okay. I really am. You can sit down. Get comfortable. Okay. You don't look very comfy. I'm comfortable here. This is so comfy. Come on, I don't bite. Unless you're into that. <laughs> I don't know. Come here. Okay. I like your wall color. Thanks. My mom picked it out. 
really nice. So, um, do you want to watch a movie? Yeah, we can do that if you want. Okay, what movie do you want to watch? It doesn't matter. Not like we're going to be paying attention. Oh, look! I found the remote! Oh, I like this movie! Oh, my back hurts. Oh look, I love this scene. <laughs> this is so funny. One piece. Four. Thanks. Throw this away. No, don't worry about it. I'll take care of it. I'm really thirsty. Can you get me some water? Um. Yeah. Sure. Be right back. Don't go in there. <laughs> okay. I'm back. Yay. Did you miss me? <laughs> yeah. There you go. Thanks. It's good. Now where were we? Wow, that water went through me really fast. I have to pee. I'll be right back. JJ. Yeah. Do you not want to kiss me? Do you not want to kiss me? Um, no. It's not that. I've just... I've just never kissed a boy before. Well, I've never kissed anyone, actually. Oh, well, I don't mind. I can teach you. I always thought my first kiss would be with a girl because I thought I was a lesbian, but you confuse me. I get that a lot. Really? No. I think, I think I want to kiss you. Okay. Hold on, there's something I have to do first. This is a big girl moment. Calls for a big girl hairstyle. Okay. You look good. Okay, come here. I'm here. Ready? Yeah. You? I guess. Yeah. Don't be nervous. You're gonna love it. Okay. I really hope so. Yeah, sorry, Carlos. I'm gay. I'm definitely gay. Okay. That did absolutely nothing for me. Okay. Close. Sure. Wow. I feel so much better. Everything is so clear now. Happy I could be of service. Well, I'm gonna go. See you at school tomorrow. See ya. Why does this always happen to me? I wonder who that is. Oh my god. JJ, I'm here, and I bought something for everyone. Oh my god, like you got booze? No, I bought homemade cupcakes. Um, thanks. I'm sure everyone will like, love these. Yo, are those weed cupcakes? No, Ugh, lame. Um, that one like fell over. Oh, weed? I thought you said tweed. <laughs> yes, they're weed. Definitely. JJ, you the man. Yeah, you can have the ugly one. Oh my god. This is nasty. I put my blood, sweat, and tears into those. <sighs> oh my god, what? Those are like the ingredients for cupcakes? That's disgusting. I did not know that. Oh, shit, sorry. Well, I just want to get high anyway, so. 
Bro, I think I'm already feeling it. Um, like, why does the container say, like, stop and shop? It does, doesn't it? I've got to take the sticker off. Okay, they're not homemade. I have no idea how to cook. Oh my god, you like having weed cupcakes at stop and shop? I did, like, not know they were doing that now. No, I was just messing with him. I want to see if the placebo effect is real. Oh, I don't get it. <laughs> By the way, I really like your new look. Thanks. JJ, you made it. I've been waiting for you. Come join us. We're about to place in the bottle. Oh, goody. Hey, everyone. I bought cupcakes, but Bodie ate all of them before they made it past the front door. Weed cupcakes. Bro, I'm feeling it so hard. They're not like really weed cupcakes. That's so embarrassing. My arms feel so heavy, bro. JJ, we've all gone, so it's your turn. What? I have to go now? I'm not prepared. <laughs> You're fine. Spin. I hope it lands on me. Okay. Come on. It's not happening, so I'm not worried. Come on, come to me. Place. No, keep going. Please, bro, give me a second chance. We've already kissed before, and it wasn't good. There's no point. Wait, you guys kissed? Oh, perfect. Then you shouldn't need to again. Why did I not, like, know about this? Rules are rules. Bro, have you ever, like, noticed how weird our hands um, look? The whole point of this game is to, like, kiss people you, like, haven't or wouldn't kiss, you know? She can, like, redo it. Hmm, right. She's got a point. Oh, my God. I have to kiss Gerald. Hey, it was good. <gasps> Maybe for you. You kept groping my boobs. What boobs? Um, like you've kissed him before. Uh, no, but it's Gerald. I'm tripping, bro. You can like redo it. Don't like listen to them. Oh, I'm mad. <clears throat> okay, like my rules, my party. <sighs> JJ, you can like spin again. Thanks, Emma. Yeah. Okay, that's enough. Just spin. Okay. Okay. I'm like melting into this wall. Literally not even over my dead body. I wanna go home. Are you freaking Oh joking? my god, this game is rigged. It should be me. That's interesting. Oh my god, Zoe. I don't like wanna play anymore. Okay. That's like worse than Gerald. This is awkward. We're like best friends. Best friends make the best lovers. Okay. Go to the closet. The closet? I thought we just kissed for a second, like, right here. Maybe for, like, middle school spin the bottle. I hope you guys know it's, like, bullshit. You're not playing by the rules. We're in high school. We're mature. We do seven minutes in heaven. What? Do I even want to know what that is? We're, like, seven minutes in hell with Gerald. So, basically, we go in the dark closet by ourselves, and we have seven minutes to do whatever we want. Have fun. It took me long enough to come out of the closet. I don't really want to go back you in. You don't have to. Um, like, you don't have to do anything you don't want to. I had to kiss Gerald. Hey. <sighs> okay. Let's go then. Okay. This will be fun. I think I just like people. Or I just like sex. I'm not sure. So you're pansexual? No, I'm straight. But you'd kiss anyone? Yeah. Except Taylor. I don't believe you. I just, I just don't see it. I really wouldn't. She's too mean. And I like when people are mean. But she's not the fun kind of mean. You know what I mean? I meant that I don't believe that you'd kiss anyone. Except Taylor. Kiss me and I'll prove it. Are you sure? Oh my god, you're like so hot. I was not expecting this. Oh my god, you're like so hot. I was not expecting this.
exciting this. Mm. 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 I'm gonna do that to You look really good. I'm gonna have this. Me too, but mostly with my pillow. You so fooled oh, yourself that you assume I'm looking at you. I'm looking at the wall. It's more interesting. I'm like so addicted to you. Oh my god. Stop looking at me. Oh, but you like shut up. Zoe, I hate to break it to you, but you're not sweet. Spaghetti is straight. Not after you heat it up. Exactly. Oh. Mm, I can't stand hairs anymore. Oh. I'm going to leave. Will you shut up with your oh. stupid accent and oh. trying to listen? Actually, oh. I think I'll stay all night just to bother you. You're pretty slutty. You're into it. Yeah. Oh my god. Damn it. In my country, we don't do this. You know, like, oh, of course we do. I just meant that where I'm from, we don't fraternize with other people while we're talking mm. to someone. Um, you're like from England. Okay, what's your point? Um, it's England. It's not like that different. Oh my god, you're just like so desperate. You know, like, oh, look out. Of course we do. I just meant that where I'm from, we don't fraternize with other people while we're talking mm. to someone. Um, you're like from England. Okay, what's your point? Um, it's England. It's not like that different. Oh my god, you're just like so desperately special. Okay, at least my breast size isn't the most interesting thing about me. You just like insulted yourself, Skeeter Bites. Oh. I don't want to break these. Oh no, I don't want this to end. We only have three minutes left. I can get it done in three minutes. Get what done? You. Oh, oh. Am I ready for this? I've never done this before. Oh, no pressure. Think it through. Fork it. I'm ready. Okay. Um. Wait, are, are you? Oh, wait. Do you wanna? Are, are you a top? Are, are you a top? I don't know. Don't worry, I'm experienced. This is very sweet of you, Zoe. What are they doing in there? Where is there? These are some really complicated pants. Where is here? It's one single zipper. Who is here? I'm usually a lot smoother. Am I here? <sighs> Such complex questions. Here, let me help. I think they're doing it. Are you joking? Doing it. Um, no. JJ's like a virgin. She wouldn't like do that. It's stuck. Ow. Oh my god. Yeah. What have I done? This game is your idea. Okay, help me pull them off. Okay. Ow. Ow. Jesus. You're not moving. Ow. Ew. Everything is doing. This was my chance. Did you super glue these on? Do this. Do that. Yes. I'm saving myself for marriage and I just wanted to be extra sure. Oh. Really? No. Why not just be, you know? This is the worst party okay. I've ever been to. And time's up. I really fucked up. Oh my god. Quick. Yeah. What are they doing in there? Finally. Finally. And now. Time's up. No. Quick. I was really excited. Oh well. I'm gonna be a 40 year old virgin. Oh. oh my god, JJ, like put your pants on. It took me so long to get them off. That was miserable. Zoe, did you actually just make up with JJ? Oh yeah. We almost did more. I had my chance and I blew it. Hey, that was like really fun. Okay, who's next? Not me, I'm over this game. Wait, for what? Why did I like that so much? Oh my God, it's me, Emma. I'm like having a crisis. I should have practiced kissing more. That was way too fun. I'm like really confused now. Um, Casey, like what are you doing here? I told you like you weren't invited. This is my house. Oh, uh, this is your house. Wait, we're not at my house. Um, please don't make me leave. I'm never invited to anything. Well, why are you here? I was just given an address. I'm innocent, I swear. This is awkward. Um, like, Mrs. Smith told us we could, like, host this party here. Mrs. Smith is my mom. Oh. I'm at a party right now? Okay, well, you're still not, like, invited. Can you, like, go to your room? Are you joking? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Yo. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. oh, my God. Are you kidding me? If someone is f***ing in my room, I'm gonna lose it. Yes,
Oh, snuck upstairs. Who's not here? I'm very much here, unfortunately. Whoever they are, they're dead. The Wama. Let's go see. Oh my God, this is like so fun. Honey. Mom? Dad? Didn't I teach you enough? JJ, what are you doing at a high school party? You are not allowed. Don't you think that's a bit hypocritical? What are you doing? And why? Honey, it's just a high school party. I just wanted to feel young again. What is wrong with that? So many things. Oh, I'm sorry. Is your Botox and boob job that my dad pays for not good enough to make you feel young again? N no, honey. Life is not all about looks, okay? I have been begging my dad to pay for my horseback riding lessons for years, and he still won't. Yet he has no problem paying for your cosmetic surgeries. But, hey, take that up with him. Uh, uh, no, don't take that up with me. JJ, you're being very disrespectful. You're interrupting my private time. You're interrupting my high school party. That you're not allowed to be at. Where is mom? I don't know. Okay, but I'm not understanding why you had to hook up in my room. Uh, um, excuse me, young lady. My room was occupied by one of your party goers, okay? And I didn't want to interrupt because I heard someone crying. This isn't even my party. I, I wasn't even invited. Yeah, and you're like still not. And you need to respect that young lady. What the frick? Wait, like, who's, like, in her room? Bruh. Oh, my God, Mike. Bruh. Are you, like, in here alone? Yes, bruh. Like, leave me alone. Oh, my God. Okay, like, sorry. That's it. Party's over. Everyone get the fuck out of my house. Bruh. You two, get out. Um, Dad, can you drive me home? No. If you figured out a way to sneak out and get here, then you can figure out a way to get home. Okay. Doll face. The girls are in the basement. Go on down and join them. We're having filet mignon for dinner, hon. How would you like it cooked? Mm, yeah, I would like it cooked. Thank you. Poor people are so weird. Hi, guys. Thanks for inviting me to your party. My mom made me invite you, so if you could just, like, stay out of our way and be quiet, thanks. I got you a present. Wow, a homemade gift. Cool. I love your braids. Mm, thanks. Mm. Oh, and how cute. You brought your horsey. What's his name? Yeah, what's his name? Her name is Buttercup. <coughs> Loser. <coughs> Say hi to our new friends. I love horses so much. I can even do jumps like them. Oh, show us. Really? No one ever wants to see. I'm sending this to everybody. She's such a loser. Um, why are you taking a video? So I can show everybody how cool you are, and now you can be one of the popular girls. Really? Okay, group selfie. Okay. Uh, JJ, can you just like stand on the end? I want to be next to my best friends and you're not one of them. Okay. Ew, don't touch me. Okay, one, two, three, cheese. Cute. You're cropping her out, right? Yeah. Okay, never have I ever gotten so drunk that I had to call my mom to come pick me up because I started crying. It only happened once. Okay, JJ, it's your turn. Never have I ever had my first kiss. Oh my God, what a loser. <laughs> I'll be your first kiss. Really? Do you want to kiss me, JJ? Okay. You're really pretty. Okay. Come here. Okay, close your eyes. Okay, one, two, three. <laughs> you really thought I would kiss you? What, are you a lesbian? JJ's a lesbian. JJ's a lesbian. No, you've probably been looking at our boobs all night. <laughs> what boobs? You're flatter than the earth flat, so... That's why. How does it feel, bitch? Mommy! Kill me. Mommy. What do you want now? JJ called me flat chested. Well, you are, honey. But don't worry, you'll get some boobs when you go through puberty. Maybe. And if not, you can just get a boob job like me. Tell her to go home. Nobody likes her. I like her. She's been making fun of me all night. Has she? Yeah, because you're a loser and you're embarrassing to be even seen with. No. You think you're cute because you carry that little horsey around? You're such a weirdo. No wonder no one's ever kissed you. I got plenty of hoes, bitch. What did I do? You did me a favor, hon. No, I'm gonna go to jail for the rest of my life. Don't worry, hon. We'll take care of it. Ricardo, it happened again. We're gonna need the shovel. Thank you. So fun, how's school going? Ah, shit. What happened? I'm dead. Or am I? Why does my head hurt? Who are you? Hey, Jay. I'm... 
I'm your best friend. Oh. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You're so pretty. Really? She is, yeah. She is. Oh. Come on, JJ. Let's go to my room and play. Okay. Okay, you kids have fun. Hey, I just... I honestly don't remember anything. Okay, well, just ask me whatever you want to know, and I can just remind you. Okay. Um, how long have we been best friends? Hmm, well, a really long time, but you actually just admitted to me yesterday that you have dinners for me. I think you're a lesbian. Huh. Well, I guess that makes sense. Yeah, you told me you wanted to kiss me, actually. I did? Yeah. You're very pretty. Yeah. Jaja, it's time to go home. Jaja, it's time to go home. Dad, I was about to kiss my girlfriend. What? What? I'm your girlfriend. You're my girlfriend. I'm your girlfriend. Yeah. Damn it, all my kids are gay. Why are all my kids gay? I thought being gay was hereditary and I'm not gay and my wife is not gay, so maybe I'm the gay one. Oh my god. Dad, you ruined everything. Jaja, get your ass downstairs and into the car. Now, fine. I'll see you at school tomorrow and you can hold my hand all the way to class. Okay. She will do no such thing. See ya, sweet stuff. See ya later. Yeah, you will. Are you cheating on mom with my girlfriend's mom? Mind your own business. Let's go. See ya, kiddo. What the hell? Oh man, I forgot my locker coat again. She's gonna be so mad at me. Is that girl new? What do you want, JJ? I'm at work. Mom, did you wipe my locker code down anywhere? I forgot it again. Hm. I've never seen her before, but she's prettier than you, Zoe. Might have to replace you as my best friend, especially with that crooked nose. <laughs> no, I didn't, JJ. It's not my responsibility to keep track of your locker code. You need to learn to be independent and start to take care of yourself, because I'm not going to be able to do it forever. Is this about Brody? Because I won't talk to him again. Again? <sighs> I deserve that one. You need to go to the front desk and tell them that you forgot okay. your lock combination like a big girl. And no, it's not about him. I just have a reputation to uphold. I can only be friends with nines, no eights or tens, because I have to be the prettiest, but I also can't be seen with ugly people. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Wait. I am at work trying to put a roof over our head, and I don't need calls from my daughter who doesn't know how to do anything for herself. Whatever. Casey, do you know her? Hang on. What are you doing? I'm writing the answers to my science test on my hand. <sighs> You're so smart, Casey. Crunchy. So fucking annoying. Shit. I ran out of room. Give me your hand. I'm gonna be fucking late for class again. <laughs> Bitch, I have a blood condition. The ink is going to like seep into my blood and make my condition worse. It'll be fine. Do you know that girl or what? Who? <sighs> There's no way. What? That's JJ freaking Johnson. The geeky horse girl? Mm-hmm. I'm gonna be late for class. You're high. Yeah, but I can still see. You guys got high without me? No, you were with us. Maybe I do have a concussion. No, you're just stupid. JJ. Come here. Me? Yes, you, dingbat. See? Told you. Wow. Uh, hey, Casey. What's up? And by what's up, I mean, why are you talking to me? Wow, she's rude, too. I like her. You look different in a good way. We like your new look. Oh, um, I just didn't have time to wave my hair this morning. Well, you don't look ugly anymore. What Zoe is trying to say is that you shouldn't braid your hair anymore. It makes you look like a dork. Really? It, it, it kind of like who I am though. Oh honey, nobody likes who you are. My mom does and, and my dad does sometimes. Don't wear the braids again, okay? Okay. You're sitting with us at lunch today, so cancel your other plans. Okay. Well, I mean, I didn't really have other plans. I usually just eat alone in the bathroom. Do not ever repeat that. See you at lunch. Okay. Bye. Wow. They're so cool. Oh, there she is. JJ. Hey, guys. Sit. Okay. It's so nice to have people to sit with for lunch. What is that? My lunch? Ew. JJ, it's okay to be poor, but we just don't want to flaunt it. My dad packed me that. Yeah, exactly. Okay, first rule of being popular, we don't bring lunch from home. We buy it. Okay, I can do that. I just 
I just don't have any money on me. Here, you can borrow my dad's credit card. I, I don't think I can. <laughs> yes, you can. He won't notice the charges. Trust me. He really won't. No, I mean, I don't, I don't think the lunch ladies accept credit. Ew, no, I didn't mean to buy lunch here. We get DoorDash delivered. Here, order whatever you want. You're allowed to get food delivered here? Yeah, of course. Principal Asman is like totally our girl. She lets us do whatever we want. Plus, she really likes DoorDash. Oh, there she is. Hey, Jesse. Jesse? You're on a first name basis with the principal? Yeah. Hey, girls. Hey, Jesse. JJ. What are you doing with popular girls? You're not popular. Um, we love JJ. She's one of us now. Eh. I am? Wait, you already know JJ? Well, yeah, I still am the principal. I have to know all my students. Really? Who's that? Um, that's... Ma I think I have a sinus infection again. Ma Mark. That's Gerald. I've like never seen that boy in my life. Yeah, I have no clue, to be honest. I don't actually do my job. I only remember JJ because I used to sleep with her dad. <gasps> Stop. What? SEQ? Eh, not really, but... Not too bad in bed. Ew, la la la, I can't hear you. La 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 la. No, 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 I don't want to hear about my dad in bed. That's really disgusting. Ew, I don't want to hear this either in bed. La 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 la. No, no, I don't want to know this. La 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 la. I feel like I'm supposed to be doing something right now. I'm traumatized. Oh, shit, I'm late for a meeting with the superintendent. I'm gonna get fired. Just give him some please don't fire me head. <laughs> that always works for me. Girl, how do you think I got this job? All right, I'll see you guys later. Is that what I'm gonna have to do to get a job? <laughs> I like her, she's funny. So, JJ, what's your body count? I've never hurt anyone. <laughs> I never, I would never. I like her, she's funny. I wasn't joking. So you met how many people have you slept with? Oh, well, that's a weird question. Uh, I have to think. Damn, she has to count. You're better than I thought. Okay, so my friend Cassie once. Nice, that's pretty gay. Um, Emma one time. My aunt Linda. Oh, my cousin Jenny. What? Mm, my oldest sister Mia. What is wrong with you? My mom. You're disgusting. What? What? You... you you asked me how many people I've slept next to before. You thought we, you thought we meant how many people you physically slept next to. <laughs> I thought you were serious for a second. JJ, you're a fucking riot, dude. I didn't know you were such a prankster. <laughs> what the fuck did they mean? Just smile and nod. So, who are you going to prom with? Prom? I'm a freshman. So? You all go to prom. With who? I don't know, like any of the creepy seniors that want to bring a younger girl? Well, who are you going with? <laughs> Brody. Brody. Brody asked you? Yeah, he asked you too. No, but he doesn't have to. We're a thing. He knows we're going together. I don't think he does. Maybe it's because you're a thing with a lot of boys. <gasps> you freaking bitch! I just got my eyelashes done! Oh, boo hoo! Go cry to Brody about it. The only time I cried to him is with happy tears from our sex being so good. You slept with my Brody? Yeah, and he has some freaking amazing moves. I gave him those moves. Yeah, well, you also gave him chlamydia. Chlamydia is not a big deal. It goes away with antibiotics. You would know. Oh, you're a freaking bitch, Zoe. <laughs> so they're best friends. Yeah, that's how they show their love. It seems kind of toxic. Aren't all the best relationships? No. Stupid. <laughs> fucking, fucking hate you. Hey, remember that time we dated for like a week and then I dumped you? Shut up. Nobody knows that and it's gonna stay that way. To this day, I still don't understand what I was thinking. <sighs> it's cause I got that concussion and couldn't remember anything or think straight. Like literally, I was straight before that. <gasps> and then boom, head injury and I'm suddenly gay and dating you. I don't think so. Maybe someone hit you over the head with a flying pan. What? <laughs> Do you know something? No, I don't I don't think so. Girls? Let go of me! Oh no! AJ? Mom? You're home? Am I home? Bobby? Wh whose house are we at? Oh, is it not familiar to you? 
It's probably because you're never here. Now listen, young lady, I had you very young and I didn't get to have fun because I was raising you. Now you're old enough to take care of yourself and I wanna go out and get late, okay? Your father was a deadbeat and couldn't last longer than two minutes. I have never known satisfaction and happiness in all of my adult years until now, okay? Why does it have to be my dad? I have never known satisfaction and happiness in all of my adult years until now, okay? Why does it have to be my dad? Oh, he's just one of many, honey. Does he know that? No, but when you care about someone, you don't tell them things that are gonna hurt them, okay? I don't think that's great advice. Well, you know what? You don't get out much. That's true. Why am I even your friend? <laughs> what are they doing? Arguing over a boy. Girl, knock it off. Life is too damn short to be fighting over boys, okay? I can hate you. Uh, let go of my hair! You stupid bitch! There's plenty of him to go around. Didn't your mother teach you that Sharon is caring? I don't wanna share Taylor's chlamydia. <laughs> Yeah, no, don't share the chlamydia. Never mind. They'll figure it out. Okay, bye. You can leave now. Uh, wait a minute, young lady. I was coming to see if you wanted anything at the store. I'm going to run some errands. What store? Lick. Uh -uh. <laughs> Licka licka. Or oh, do you like Saturday sips better? I'm good. I have enough for the weekend. What? Okay. You need any condoms or anything else? No, still gay. Yeah, I still don't know how that happens. Zoe, Taylor, yeah, you need any condoms? Yeah, get me the biggest box you can find. I have a long weekend planned. You freaking bitch, Zoe. <laughs> okay, um, what what size condom? <laughs> Zoe, the biggest ones. Bernie's not even that big. Maybe you've just never got him fully hard. What? The girls are giving me a headache. Now I remember why I have to get home. Let go of me! Why did you let me have one more thing? Oh my god, Zoe, Taylor, knock it off! Apologize and make up. We have more important shit to do. Sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. That Brody likes me better. What? I said I'm sorry. I like you so much better. Okay, so prom is in a week. Taylor, can you please just let Zoe go with him? Why can't you go with your boyfriend? Fine. She has a boyfriend. Okay, I need help deciding who I'm gonna go to prom with. This is very important. How many people have asked you? Three? Damn. I really value all of your opinions. Except JJ, she's still learning. Fail enough. I'm just happy to be here. Okay, I've made a very important PowerPoint to go over the pros and cons of each candidate. Please pay attention. This is so extra. Do we get popcorn? Okay, first candidate. That wasn't a rhetorical question. Rose. She kind of looks like me. No, she doesn't. She's way prettier than you. 17. Ben, she lay. Pros, super pretty. She is pretty. Captain of the cheerleading team. Super wealthy family. JJ, are you paying attention? Sorry. Has leadership qualities. Probably good in bed. That's fair. How do you know that? Next. Okay, the cons. Crystal lesbian. What's a crystal lesbian? Small boobs. I have small boobs. There's nothing wrong with small boobs. Shoes with mouth open. And hooked up with Emma Whitlock. Hey, I like Emma. I mean, everyone's hooked up with Emma Whitlock. Candidate number two. Okay, now she looks like me if I put my hair in a bun. Now we have Dylan. Oh my god, stop flattering yourself. 16, switch, she, her. She's also way prettier than you. Pros. So smart that she skipped a few grades. Pretty hot. I have a question. Big booty. Never mind. Plays basketball. Definitely equal as much a top as a bottom. I don't understand this lesbian slang. Very important. Again, how would you know that? Next, we have the column. Do guys do this? Kind of young. Not sugar mama. That's a hard pass. Brody is her brother. Oh my god, that's Brody's sister? Shorter than me. Ew. And drinks cow milk. Should I be taking notes? What's wrong with cow milk? It's a red flag. Next up, and lastly, we have Max. Next up, and lastly, we have... Oh, wait, they're cute. Max. 18, trans mask, they them. They literally look like me, too. It's older. Can call them daddy. I'll call them daddy. Taller than me. I like that. Haven't dated anyone non-binary yet. Skateboards. Hot. <sighs> This is like getting boring. Always smells amazing. Okay, cons? Have heard that they're a pillow royalty. 
I see what you did there. Oh, I get it. That's it. That's all the cons. Oh, is there one more candidate? What is this? What's that? No, please. No, no, no. Casey, what is this? No, I really don't. No, no. Is that me? No idea. Okay, what do we think? Are we just gonna ignore what just happened? Taylor, I'm not gay. I don't look at girls like that. So helpful. Thanks, Taylor. Oh, I'm so confused. Okay, what do we think? Are we just gonna ignore what just happened? Taylor, I'm not gay. I don't look at girls like that. So helpful. Thanks, Taylor. You're welcome. Oh, I'm so confused. Zoe, are you freaking sleeping? Oh, what the hell? You know what? You guys are kind of abusive. You fell asleep during my presentation. Um, last time I checked, school ended two hours ago. Whatever, who was your favorite? Um, the, the redhead. There was no redhead. I mean, the one that started with the letter, um, D? Dylan? Yep, Dylan, that's the one. Mm, I don't know. Oh, and Brody's her brother. We can have a double date. What am I supposed to do? Hang out with JJ. JJ, what do you think? I don't know, but whatever one you don't want, can I go with? Not looking like that. You need a makeover first. They are all way too hot and mature for you. Okay. We need to fix that. Brody is literally so hot. Oh, I think you just gave me a concussion. What is going on over here? We were just fighting about who we saw coming out of the janitor's closet this morning with Mr. Higginbottom. Zoe thinks it was Mrs. Mabubi, but I could have sworn it was you. I didn't see anything. Good, neither did I. My head really hurts. Oh, bitch, what the fuck? I have a deviated septum and you're deviating it more. Brody's my ex-boyfriend, you skank. Oh my God, can you guys stop? You've had like 26 ex-boyfriends. If you don't want one of them, why can't I have one? You're both idiots. Yeah, probably because Taylor just gave me a concussion. No, I don't think that's why. Sorry, we can't all be gay, Casey. It's really not that much better. Unless you're me, because I get anyone I want. Ow. Okay, girls, time for the most difficult task of your life. Are we gonna teach the elderly how to use an iPhone? No. Thank God. We, and by we, I mean mostly me, are going to turn JJ into one of us. But I like who I am. Well, no one else does. Okay. Casey, this isn't gonna work. You can put a dress and some makeup on a nerd, but it's still gonna be a nerd. Stop. I don't need negativity in my creative space, okay? You know, I'm not actually that smart. Not everyone that wears glasses is a genius, you know. Um, everyone <laughs> shut up. I'm strategizing. This is going to be very difficult, but it can be done. I know it can be done. Let me examine my canvas. Okay, I know what to do. Well, I'm gonna have to twist you because I can't see anything. Brush. You're in Casey's hands now. You will be beautiful. Yeah, okay. <laughs> What's wrong? Nothing. <laughs> this kind of hurts. Got some thick ass hair, girl. <laughs> like a wolf. Ow! Ow! Beauty is pain, JJ. <laughs> it's all right. <laughs> you broke the brush. I didn't do anything. I'm just sitting here having my hair whipped out. What kind of conditioner do you use? Um, a four in one. Absolutely not. Spray bottle. Product. Are you ready? What am I, a dog? Wolf? <sighs> Hair curler. Here you go. Oh, what the frick, Zoe? Dumbass, don't hand me the hot side. How am I supposed to know what side is hot? No one's home in there, huh? And where? I rest my case. 
Well, I'm not resting mine. Ow. Ow. Ow, Casey, my ear. Casey, my ear is burning. Ow. Oh. Beauty is pain. Beauty is pain. Beauty. Beauty. Tweezers. Huh. God, not even my dog has this much hair on her face. No, no, please. No, no, no. No. Oh my God. This is the least amount of fun I've ever had. I think the last time you groomed yourself. Okay. Makeup. Makeup. I don't know if I have your color. I literally have the same exact skin color as you. I think you're right. Mm hmm. Hmm. You're in luck. Great. Huh. Would you look at that? Concealer. What's that for? Imperfections. Might as well just cover her entire face. God, there's a lot. Your skin is atrocious. Thanks. What the hell do you use for skincare? Uh, water. Okay, girls. I've decided who I'm going to prom with. Rose. Dylan. Max. Yes. Which one? All of them. What? What? I'm confused. Well, I couldn't decide, so I said yes to all of them. Um, Casey, this is not a good idea. Wait, so all four of you are gonna go together? <laughs> no, they don't know why I said yes to the others. <laughs> this is a stupid idea. Your math is not mathing. How on earth are you gonna pull this off? You guys are gonna help me. Ooh, this sounds fun. No, I'm not. Um, I don't remember agreeing to that. I volunteered you. When? <laughs> Just now. Okay. But what about our prom dates? Taylor, someone finally asked you? No. Then what's the problem? Mm hmm That's my thought. Well, I don't have anyone to go with, so I'll help you, Casey. That's the attitude that I like to see. I'm just happy to be here. Why can't you guys be as obedient as JJ? I'm not a dog. You are her bitch. I guess I am a dog. Well, I'll help, but I'm going with Brody, so... Oh, good. He can help, too. Okay, he'll be so delighted to hear that. I'm so excited. Okay, come close. This is the blueprint of the space. How did you get this? Principal Aspen. She's so cool. I know. Anyway, since I said yes to Rose, Dylan, and Max, they all have to think that I'm only there with them. Fortunately for me, they're all in different cliques, so they will all be sitting at different tables. So I'm going to spend a few minutes with each and then make an excuse and then go to the next, etc. Um, can you go back and last? This is not the word. You guys are going to help me distract the ones I'm not with so they don't go looking for me. I'm on. Okay, screw me then, whatever. Okay, now for the fun part. We're each gonna have a little earpiece so we can alert each other if one of them is about to cross paths. I literally couldn't think of anything less fun. We're going undercover? This is way too much for my brain to handle. Or if someone's getting a little too suspicious. That's so cool. Is this what the popular kids always do? Capiche? Sounds complicated. When do we get to have fun? This is fun. Right. JJ, this is your official initiation into our group. We matter too. You can help me pull this off. You're in. Casey, you never care about us. JJ, this is your official initiation into our group. If you can help me pull this off, you're in. Do I get a team jacket? No, we're not a dance team. Okay. We really should consider getting much though. Do you guys want me? JJ, you should never be this excited to be anyone's friend. It's pathetic. Right. Got it. I think it's kind of cute. Well, if you're so in love with JJ, why don't you go to prom with her? Whoa, attitude. I'm sorry, JJ, you're cute, but I'm not gay. Understandable. You're not my type anyway. I'm like everyone's type. What is your type? Oh, gay. <coughs> What's it to you? God, sorry for trying to seem interested in your life. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we all understand the plan. Yes. Sure. Yes. I'll see you girls tomorrow night then. Leave now. Right now? Uh, I just have to call my mom to come pick me up. It'll probably be like 15 minutes. Okay, go wait outside. I can't wait in here with you. No. Okay. Well, well why didn't you drive me? I would, but my license got suspended. And I genuinely just don't want to. Okay. 
JJ, what did you do to your hair? Sorry, I tried to do it like you did, but this is the best I could do. I've literally been working on it for hours. No, 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 no. no. Kayla, do you have a brush? You really just expect me to have everything you need on hand? Yes, I have a brush. Okay, this needs to be quick. Good. Wow, you weren't kidding. I have a magic touch in more ways than one. Hm. Okay, here's your earpiece. This is the coolest thing I've ever done. Your life must be pretty boring. Not really. And this is a walkie that you can talk through. Testing, testing, one, two, three. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you and you're also standing right in front of me. Nice. Where the hell is Zoe? is Brody. Oh, he's still getting dressed. He'll be here soon. How did you get dressed so quick? Um, I never took this off. Oh, I don't want to know anymore. Are you joking? You steal my boyfriend and now my dress too? Um, this is my dress. It's the same fucking one I'm wearing, dipshit. Cute. Twinsies. No, not cute. We can't be wearing the same dress. Why not? I don't care about your minor inconveniences. Do we all remember the plan? Yes. I studied it all night. Yes, you only told me 47 times. Yes. Wait, no. What's that? Zoe, you are literally the most useless human being. Yeah, but it's not my fault. I got it. Casey has three prom days, but none of them know about each other. So our job is to make sure that they don't find out. Okay. But at least someone listens. I'm listening. I just don't really care. Where's your earpiece? Cute. Just lit, bro. I know. All the older hot girls are wearing short dresses. I'm in the atmosphere, but yeah. Dude, how are we even here? We're freshmen. Principal Asman's like a regular customer of mine. Well, that's dope. Thanks for taking me as your date. Why do you do air quotes around date, bro? Because we're not actually on a date. Oh, uh, wait, dude. Did you think we were like going to? prom together no bro of course not all right good bro because that would have been hella awkward yeah mike this is a formal event no hats allowed i can't take this off bro take it off no man please no one has ever seen you without it my is against hat, dress code. take it off or i will have you best why you always just stick up your ass man No, man, please. No one has ever seen you without it my hat. against bro. dress code. Take it off or I will have you escort. Why do you always just stick up your ass, man? Dude, what, bro? Your hair is gorgeous. Really? Yeah, bro. If you were a girl, I would, like, totally be into you. Bruh. Follows. JJ. You clean up nicely. You. You look beautiful. I know. So, are you, um, are you still a lesbian? Last time I checked. Yes. Well, how recently have you checked? What do you mean, Oh. Come on, bud. You deserve to spend time with someone who appreciates your company. Yeah. Okay, have fun. Oh, it's... Hello, love. You look beautiful. You look amazing. I'm so happy you made it. Yeah, but typically when someone asks you to be their date for prom, you two are supposed to go together. I understand. So, I was rather surprised when you said you wanted to meet me here. I'm so sorry. My friend was having a crisis. I just... I really needed to be there for her. What? None of us will have no crisis. She's telling you. She couldn't arrive with anyone, otherwise her cover would be blown. Oh. Where, where does this go? Keep up. I don't mean this right. Oh, I'm so sorry. That's completely understandable. You're such a good friend for doing that. Good friend? <laughs> That's laughable. Will you join me at my seat? Of course. Hello? Is this why I'm walking with Rose for a seat? No. Clear. Over. Hello? This is so fun. 
<laughs> Sorry, love, did you say something? Oh, no, that wasn't me. Hello? Casey, can you hear me? My apologies. Sometimes I hear voices. I think they may be my spiritual guides, but... I don't think this, like, matches my dress. I can never make out what they're saying. <laughs> I think mine's clogged. Casey, my love. I have a very important question. Okay. So, um, what is your astrological sign? Um, I'm Gemini. <gasps> oh, God! Okay, um, May or June? June. Okay. Casey, that's a red flag. Over. Okay, see, who's your favorite musician? Casey, one date number two has a wife. I repeat, one date number two has a wife. Fuck Dylan. Hmm, I don't know Fuck Dylan. What genre are they? What? You said your favorite musician was the band Fuck Dylan. I'm not familiar with them. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they're, they're good. Do you think you could show me a song to see if I recognize it? Hmm. Yep. Okay. Oh, you mean like, you mean like right now? Wait, are Dylan and Brody twins? You guys dated and he never introduced you to his sister? Must have not been that serious. He got me a promise ring. They're here somewhere. I'm a big supporter of the arts. Oh crap, Dylan is walking around for Casey. <laughs> oh my god, Casey, hide. Dylan is looking your way. Casey, are you okay? We need a doctor over here. No, no, shh, shh, I'm fine. What is wrong with you? Oh my god, Casey, hide. Dylan is looking your way. Casey, are you okay? We need a doctor over here. No, no, shh, shh, I'm fine. What is wrong with you? Sorry, I just got like really stressed and I just like needed a moment to myself. If you really can't decide on a song to show me from Dylan, it's not that big of a problem. I will just look it up myself. No! Oh, what gives? Well, you really better hope that just didn't break. Gemini's are crazy. Guys, this is not going well. I just threw Rose's phone across the room. What? Over. You good thing you have two more options. Over. Go distract Dylan until I can sleep away. Watch that. Over. Well, I should really write a good Amazon review for this phone case. <laughs> so you're not mad that I just whipped your phone across the room? I think you're quite crazy, but truthfully, love, I just need a little more excitement in my life. Hi, baby. What's up, Angel? Long time no see. And by long time, I mean like 10 minutes, but 10 minutes feels like forever without you, baby. <laughs> you're so funny. So. This is the infamous Brody that I've heard so much about. What have you heard about me? That's your player. Thanks. Hi, Brody. Hey, nice to meet you. What's your name? <sighs> That's not funny. Did I say something wrong? Did you guys even date? Oh my god, yes, for like nine months. Of um, what? No, that's not ringing a bell. That's like so pathetic for you, Taylor. Oh, you know what? Now I remember. You were the one that slapped me around while I'm in bed. That sounds about like white. My stool old friend. Please excuse my idiot brother. He dates like 500 girls a month. What? So you were cheating on me when we were together? No, baby. I was cheating on everyone else with you. Oh my god. Taylor, well, didn't you two have like five boyfriends at the same time? Yeah, but it's different when I do it. They were more like than I thought. Up to us. Well, didn't you two have like five boyfriends at the same time? Yeah, but it's different when I do it. They were more like than I thought. Up to us. That's embarrassing. Uh, baby, does this mean you have other girls like me now? No, baby, you're different. Oh, okay, good. Oh, well, this thing. Anyway, I'm Dylan. I'm Casey's date. You guys are her friends, right? In the flesh. Wait, you look really familiar. We went to that sleepover together a few months ago with Cassie and Emma. Oh my god, that was you? Yep. Whatever happened to Cassie? Um, she's in a Canadian here. Jesus. Anyway, do you guys know where I can find Casey? No. You go sit down in your seat and I will find her and bring her to you. I mean, I can just go look. No, go sit down. Okay. Brody, um, do you want to go grab a drink? Yeah, they um, Joey, aren't you forgetting something? No. Nothing? A condom. Do you have one? You sus. Let's go. Okay. Be right back, JJ. Maybe. Casey, Dylan is getting a little too curious. You need to go say hi to her. Now, over. 
Rose, um, I need to use the restroom. I'll be right back. I can go. I can come with you. No. I mean, no, thank you. I'm just, I'm just extremely pee shy, but thanks. Okay, just take your time then, I guess. I will. Hey, you look great. I got you a drink. I put a little in there. Oh, great. Cheers. I was thirsty. Oh. Casey, Max is here. I will repeat, Max, one day number two, has entered the building and they are walking around trying to find you. Over. And I still am. I'm gonna go get some more. Okay, I'll still be working on my first by myself. Okay, this is ridiculous. Oh my god. Casey, Rose is heading to the bathroom to look for you. Well, I have to go meet Max. Do something. Roger. Over. What do we do? I don't know. Zoe. 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 Zoe, we need your help. Over. Zoe. 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 She's a goner. JJ, Rose is going to the bathroom and she's going to realize that Casey's not in there. We need to do something, quick. Do something. I'll improvise. Casey. Casey, love, are you okay? <laughs> oh my God, are you okay? <laughs> no, my boyfriend just broke up with me. He told me we were going to get married. <laughs> he bought me a party wig and made me promise we wouldn't have sex until marriage. And then I called him cheating on me with someone else. Very much having sex. Jesus, love, you have a rough night. <laughs> He told me we were gonna get married. <laughs> he bought me a party wig and made me promise we wouldn't have sex until marriage. And then I called him cheating on me with someone else. Very much having sex. Jesus, love, you have a rough night. Wait, now you broke up with you after he cheated. Yeah, because I'm a loser and I wanted to give him a second chance and he thought that was pathetic, so he dumped me. A jerk. Before I give you any more advice, I must know, what is your astral uh, Um, Gemini. Ah! Not again. Can you please stay with me for a little while and comfort me? I'm too sad to be alone. <laughs> please, Rose. Um, yes, of course. <laughs> Wait, how do you know I mean? Um. Because I secretly have a huge crush on you. I know who you were all year. Oh my god. This is heavy stuff. Wait, so are you bisexual then? No, I'm a lesbian. You just said you had a boyfriend. Um. I was twine again. I understand. I don't know, I'm a Gemini. What's in your ear? Um. What are you listening to? Just the relaxing sounds of horses neighing. It calms me. Hmm. Okay. Oh, sorry. Oh, it's okay. Wait, you're Emma Whitlock, right? Yeah. Oh my God. I've heard like so much about you. Like good or bad? Honestly, it's mixed. That's fair. So like, what are you listening to? What? Like, like your earpiece. Oh, um, it's Rihanna's new album. What? Rihanna doesn't have a new album. She doesn't even like release music anymore. Trust me, I would know. Yeah, but she could like drop something at any minute. You just like never know. I don't, I just like want to be prepared. Low key, that's like so smart. I'm a diehard for Rihanna too. Oh my God. Did we just become like besties? Yeah. Okay, next up, please put your hands together for our school's very own Woo! band who so generously offered to play tonight. Yay! Please give it up for Yeast Infection and the S Kings. Thanks, Gerald. I'm Nova. Nova? Please give it up for Yeast Infection and the S Kings. Thanks, Gerald. I'm Nova. Nova? But up here, I go by Yeast Infection. Woo! And these are the STGs. Oh my god, Nova's in a band? Thanks for having us. Who's Nova? Oh, she's like my ex, but like, 
I broke her heart and she like disappeared off the face of the earth. One, two, three. Four. I guess she started a band and became like even more emo than she already was. Wow. Story of my life, searching for the right, but it keeps avoiding me. Wait, I love live music. Sorrow in my soul, but it feels so wrong. Really likes my company. Do you want to dance with me? More than yeah. A and this is more than love. Oh my god, Brody. The sky is blue. Oh my god, Big Boob Emma. Do you know each other? I mean, because I'm gone again. Yeah, we smashed once. We did. Oh, and I know that. Good to see you. It's fine. Kills him inside. Let's go dance. You know that I can't be with some other guy. Cause I may be bad, but I'm perfectly good at it. I guess they just like. Let anyone out there. They're very supportive of the arts here. Sticks and stones may break my bones. A little too, too supportive. Even though we don't have anyone artistically inclined. This is like really bad. I can't be supportive of this. Hey guys, are we having fun? Principal Ashman, like what's the deal here? This is not good. Wait, what do you mean? Um, my ears are like bleeding. We had some budget cuts and I spent most of the budget. So we couldn't afford a real DJ, but they offered to play for free. Don't be that bad. Okay, you're kind of hot, but you're like stupid, so. Did you like listen to them sing beforehand? Okay, honestly, no. I just asked them if they would sing Rihanna songs the entire prom, and they said yes. So. Um, why not just like play Rihanna over the speaker then? Have you never tried to post a Rihanna song on social media? John Bradley, the okay, well, I bounce. I'm interviewing a sexy new PE teacher. Don't forget to try the punch. I spiked it. Thank you. That's all. I gotta say, I was kind of surprised when you agreed to be my date for prom. Really? Why? I'm not really all bad. Maxi Poo, yes you are, you're so cute. Plus, I haven't gone out with anyone non-binary yet. Thanks? No problem. So, do you have like a bucket list of different kinds of people you want to date? Date is a strong word. My list is for hookups. What else is on that list? Let's see. Okay, um, basketball player, dominatrix, someone shorter than five feet, Someone taller than six feet, a redhead. Oh, a non-binary person. Check. Hey, we haven't hooked up yet. A milf. Oh, I forgot to check that one. Impressive. A dilf, even though I'm gay, just because. Um, a cheerleader, JJ Johnson. Wait, what was that last one? A cheerleader. Uh, no, the one before that. Nothing. That was the end of the list. Let me see. Oops, muscle spasm. Okay. Wanna make out in the bathroom? Yeah. It's the most fun time of the night for nobody except them. But it is time to announce the prom king and queen. Yay! Hey guys, what did I miss? Who bugs you announced who won the Super Bowl? What happened to your face? Magic. Damn, JJ's pulling bitches. Not bitches. Attractive young women. Whatever, dude, don't make me uh, Okay, and the prom queen is Pisces, come What? Yeah! And so Pisces, she's a freshman. I genuinely don't know, but um, she got the most votes by an overwhelming amount. <laughs> Shit. Pisces, come out on the dance floor. Everyone make way, make way. Okay, now the prom king and queen will have the dance floor to themselves. Hi. Thank you. Um, to have a private dance with their dates. No. Okay, okay. okay Gerald. We don't well, need to do that, honestly. One. What do they expect? Wait, wait, what's, what's the problem? Has anyone seen Casey? Will the dates of the prom queen and king please make their way to the floor? Oh, excuse me, guys. That's that's me. Oh, shit. That's me. Okay, well, that's me. I'd rather be dancing with you. I'm really glad you feel that way. For more reason than one. Excuse me. Sorry. I wish I could find my date. Hi. No, I said their prom date. This is a private dance. The rest of the student body can have the floor after this one minute and 31 second song, okay? Gone. Be patient. No, I am Casey's date. No, I'm Casey's date. What? Uh, I see where this is going now. This is so surprising. Honestly, I'm just happy this isn't my fault. Same. No, she literally said yes to me. She said yes to me too. And I. Um, Casey? Um, do you remember that concussion I had? Last year? No, that's not. Me. Why did you say yes to all three of us? Because you're all sexy. Unbelievable. Honestly, I really don't mind. I've been making out with JJ in the bathroom this entire time, and 
was absolutely lovely. Honestly, I really don't mind. I've been making out with JJ in the bathroom this entire time, and it was absolutely lovely. Okay, this is none of my business. You fellas can take this elsewhere. I'd like to get on with my program. Guys, help me. Make something up. I look like a fool. How did you even win prom queen as a freshman? You're welcome. What? I put your name in the ballot 583 times. Why would you do that? Because you deserve the recognition, silly. You're actually the most idiotic person I've ever met in my entire life. What? Casey, Max, Dylan, I'm so sorry. It's okay. We forgive you. We understand. Really? No. Oh! Oh my god, hey guys. After party at my place. Except Casey, you're not invited. That was like super lame of you. <gasps> Yay! I mean, not yet. Want to go to the party together? I absolutely love that idea. <laughs> Bye, Casey. So, this is your first time? You want to do this on a ski lift? Okay. That'll make for an interesting story. No, I meant snowboarding. Oh, okay. Well, luckily for you, I've been snowboarding since I was three. My parents take us on a snowboarding trip every winter break. It must be nice to be up a class. Yeah. I'm kind of scared. Something about flinging myself down a mountain doesn't sound much fun. Oh my god, it's really fun. But it is really hard and you have to be really patient. But don't worry, I know what I'm doing. This doesn't seem really safe. The only thing keeping us from falling to our deaths is this tiny metal ball. If it wasn't safe, they wouldn't let us use it. Cigarettes, alcohol, pharmaceutical drugs. I could go on. If the government says it's safe, it's probably safe. So naive. Whoa, really high up. Don't think about it. I'm thinking about it. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. I don't like this, Zoe. I don't like it. I'm not meant to be this high off of the ground. Okay, ready? We're about to get off. This is going to be the hardest part. No. JJ, we're getting close. You've got to lift the bar. Okay. I can't. JJ, we have to lift the bar. I'm going to fall. I'm going to fall. <laughs> okay, just keep your board straight and push up off the seats. Ready? You did it. I did? I guess I did. Okay, now what? Okay, now we strap in and snowboard down. Okay. We're gonna do a green circle one first, right? That's the beginner one, right? First of all, nobody says the shape. You can just say green. Oh. And no, we don't need to go down those baby slopes. We're going down a blue. You'll be fine. I've never even stepped on a snowboard before, and you want me to go down an intermediate slope? I promise you'll be fine. We don't need to go down those baby slopes. We're going down a blue. You'll be fine. I've never even stepped on a snowboard before, and you want me to go down an intermediate slope? I promise you'll be fine. One second. Is this tight enough? Okay, tighter it is. Ow. Okay, I think I'm ready. Okay, let's go. Wait, where's your helmet? I don't need one. What if you fall and hit your head? I'm already kind of dumb. I don't know what more damage it would do. Plus, my hair is so thick, I think it would cushion the fall. No, you're wearing a helmet to protect your cute little boy. Where did you get that? I bought two, just to be safe. For me? No, just in case this one breaks. What kind of crazy tricks are you going to be doing? Hopefully just standing. This is so not cute. I think you look even cuter now. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's go. I did it. You're doing great. You're not. Are you okay? What do you mean? I'm doing good. I thought you was a professional. You're going kind of slow. Do you want me to wait for you? Yeah, just one sec. I'll be right there.
good. It just came to me. I guess I was meant to do this. Yeah, you're almost better than me. Almost. It took you six years to get down that one hill. I never said I was a pro. I just said I've been doing it all my life. Plus, it's mostly for the aesthetic. I never even really go down the mountain. I usually just come to take pictures. Well, can we go on? I've been waiting here for quite some time. Race you down. Something tells me I'm gonna win. Sit down. Something tells me I'm gonna win. to leave we only did one one yeah but it took like two hours to get down oh okay i guess we can go i'll make you hot chocolate and we can snuggle in my bed who this okay you have to bring me a board though those are expensive okay are we ready to start um wait actually we're waiting on one more please tell me you did not like invite gerald hi i'm right here um i didn't invite you how did you find my house it's in the school directory well i was invited this time. You're my best friend. I kind of didn't have a choice. I thought I was your best friend. I love how I have to sit on the floor, but I was part of this friend group first. So, who's the one we're waiting on? Nova. Oh, shit. Oh, is she, like, mentally sane again? Yeah. She's, like, doing great, I guess. And she's going back to school after break. I don't know, Nova. What happened to her? Emma cheated on her, and she had a mental breakdown. Oh. Oh my god, don't like just look at me. I cheated on her with Brody. Oh my god, why is it always like the girl that's the slut? It wasn't even that good. It shouldn't have even counted. So everyone has slept with Brody? Yeah. Not me. Emma, I think you're more to blame because you were the one in the relationship with Nova. I didn't like mean to cheat. Oh, that must be Nova. Hey everyone, I missed you guys. Hello. I'm British. Well, actually, I don't know like half of you. And I... Hey, Emma now, so. Hi. Nice to meet you. Hi, welcome, you can sit wherever. Okay. Nova, you look great. Thank you. Yeah, all I needed was a grippy sock vacation to cure me. Okay, well, let's get this party started. Like pink. What? What? Did you see her? No, bad joke. Nova, since you haven't gotten to do anything fun in a really long time, why don't you go first? My grippy sock vacation was pretty fun, but okay. I wouldn't know, but grab the gift that says Nova. What the hell is this for? To draw on your face because you're emo. Why would I put permanent marker on my face? Is that not what you use? Are you stupid? Brody, you just gave yourself away. You're supposed to let her try to guess who it's from. Nobody told me the rules. Okay, let's just move on. It's my grippy socks. This is the best gift I could have gotten. I go through a lot of this. That's disgusting. Guess who your secret Santa was. Was it, JJ? No, why on earth would you think I would get you queen? Be because of that time in science class. We had that moment with the cream. Uh, no, it wasn't like that. He just rubbed some cream on my hands. I wasn't your secret Santa. Move on. Hmm. <laughs> Gerald, did you buy me a big bottle of cream? Be honest, I'm your secret Santa. Gerald, how did you have a secret Santa for the party if you weren't even invited? So you just bought me cream for fun? Um, yeah, I knew you would use it. Gerald, you are so weird. Please leave my house. No, please. Please let me at least open my gift first. Nobody got you a gift because you weren't part of the Secret Santa. Nobody got me a gift. Gerald, get out of my house. Okay. Wait, so do I have another gift? Oh, yep, it's right here. Okay, I totally thought that was gonna be like so funny, but that just made it so awkward, so. Don't worry, I'll use both. Emma, um, you've been really quiet. Are you okay? Or is it just really awkward to be right next to someone you cheated on? <laughs> Okay, I'm bored. I want it to be my turn. Oh, I'll look for yours for you. Okay. Um, I don't see it. Huh. I'm not 
seen anything. Um, has anybody seen my gift? Wait, did nobody have me for their secret Santa? Okay, I'm like a little confused. So like, I got you like a secret Santa. You picked my name? Yeah, and I got you like a secret Santa. But now I'm starting to think that like I did it wrong. What do you mean you got me a secret Santa? Emma, who the hell is at the door? Your secret Santa. What do you mean you got me a secret Santa? Emma, who the hell is at the door? Your secret Santa. Ho, ho, ho! Santa's here. Who is this random man in my house? So I think I like misunderstood the concept of this game. Do you think? I was like under the impression that we were supposed to find like a real Santa. What did you think the secret part meant? Um, that their identity is like a secret. So you don't even know this man? Um, no, that's like the secret part, like I said. How did you find him? I like saw a post on Craigslist. So let me get this straight. You went on Craigslist and hired this random stranger to dress up in a Santa suit and gave him my personal home address to come to a party with a bunch of minors. Well, when you say it like that, it doesn't really sound so good. He's just standing there staring at us. I think the rules of this game need to be like more clear. That's what I'm saying. I think the rules of this game need to be like more clear. That's what I'm saying. Um, sir, I think you should leave. Are you sure? Oh, I was paid in advance, so. I mean, if you already paid for him, he might as well stay. I don't think that's a very good idea. Honestly, I think he should stay. He wasn't like cheap. You guys haven't even sat on my lap yet. No, sir, we will not be doing that. No, dude, that's my job. Then how are you going to tell Santa what you want for Christmas? Guys, what the hell do we do? Do you want me to beat his ass? Honestly, Zoe, I think for your benefit, you should just be nice to this guy because he knows where you live. And worse than that, he's already in your house. Shit. All right, Santa, you can stay. Wh what? Ho, ho, hell yeah. I promise I'm going to make your party so much more fun. All you have to do is just sit there and look pretty. Sounds like an easy job to me. Where should I sit? You see that big boob blonde right there? Yeah, she loves Santa Claus. You should sit right next to her. Okay. Where should I sit? You see that big boob blonde right there? Yeah, she loves Santa Claus. You should sit right next to her. Okay. <sighs> I do love big boobed blondes. I'm sure you do. I love Carmen. <sighs> okay, Casey, why don't you go next? Okay. No, no, there's a Santa's job. Let me get it for you. Ho, ho, here you go. Merry Christmas. Do you have something for Santa in return? Sorry, Santa. I'm a lesbian. Ho, ho, hot! Santa didn't know he was at a party with a bunch of lesbians. Okay, Casey, open your gift. I'm a dude. Oh, this is so cute. I don't even have to guess. I know exactly who this is from. Thank you, Secret Santa. You're welcome, Casey. You've been a very good girl this year. Will you shut up? Do not speak to Santa like that or I will put you on the naughty list. I bet you're already on the naughty list, huh? I think it's like my turn. Okay, I think it's like my turn. Are you like not gonna get it for me, Santa? Naughty girls don't get spoiled by Santa. Okay, like whatever. Is this like some kind of sick joke? Okay, well, who do you think your secret Santa is? I'm not like Taylor, because she's a bitch. You're right and right. I don't like stuff my bra. I don't. Well, there's only one way to find out. And then I guess like we'll never know. Yeah. My turn. And before you even try, I don't need any man to do anything for me. I think my secret Santa is Zoe. You're so right. What is it? I don't think they want you to ho ho no. What is it? It's a gift card to Home Depot. Santa knows when you're sleeping. And he knows when you're awake. And he also knows when you're lying. I'm not lying. I love Home Depot. She is a Home Depot lesbian. That does make sense. Hey, Taylor, your turn. <sighs> Santa make himself useful. Santa loves to make himself useful. And he would love to make himself useful for you. Just give me my gift.
What the hell is this? Who gave me this toy? A toy? Santa loves toys. Take it out of the bag. Santa wants to see it. The only reason I would take it out of the bag is to shove it up. Hey! Okay, okay. I was your secret Santa. I'm sorry. I thought it was a good gift. Why? I thought if you could relax yourself, you might not be so mean all the time. My dad says that. Mean people are usually just people that need to get laid. Hey, hey! This is the best night ever. Kayla, cut it out. JJ was just trying to be nice. Since when are you JJ's bodyguard? Uh, yes, Zoe, since when are you her bodyguard? <laughs> How did you get there? Santa Claus is magic. I can teleport. Santa sends danger, so we came here to protect. I don't need protection. Because you're a lesbian? Carlos, thanks, man. These are dope. How did you know it was me? Come on, bro. These girls don't know what Trojan is. They're either gay or a whore. <laughs> That's fair. Um, where did Santa go? Dude! Oh, no. Mom, what are you doing? Hot red-handed. Mrs. Smith, why are you at my house? Do you just, like, magically appear wherever there's an opportunity for sex? It's my special talent. Um, I literally, like, found this guy on Craigslist. Honey, that's where most of my men come from anyway. You found my dad on Craigslist? Okay, the party's over. Santa, you need to leave now. Yeah, gladly. I, I got paid to be here, and I got to smash his hot milf. So, I'd say tonight was a success. <sighs> Hi, sorry I'm late. Um, a girl named Emma Whitlock hired me to be here. Emma, you hired too? No. Hi guys. What's up? Why did you bring your stuffed animal? I think it's cool. It's like so in right now. This is my first sleepover ever. I'm kind of nervous. Oh my god, you've like never had a sleepover? Well, one time I slept over at my Uncle Mark's house because my parents wanted to go to a strip club. Does that count? No. Oh my god, my ex-boyfriend's name is Mark, and he was like way older than me. I would have had more fun at the strip club. Me too. It wasn't fun. He's very boring. He made me read the dictionary for five hours. Oh my god, my mom totally makes me read the dictionary too. I know so many words I shouldn't. Oh my god, girl, me too. My mom's literally a sex therapist. Okay, come sit down. We're gonna play a game. Is it spin the bottle? We're all girls. So what, Cassie? I'm literally bisexual. I'm gay. Oh, shit. I love women. I'm sorry. Like, literally, have you never seen Rihanna? JJ, I would like totally take you on a date. Like, you're pretty cute. Emma, can you get the Ouija board? Yeah. Hey, JJ, have you ever talked to ghosts? No. My best friends are ghosts. My mom told me not to ever play with a Ouija board. Come on, JJ, don't be a loser. Okay. Don't you want to be cool like us? Don't make fun of her. Okay, it's time to be serious. I don't really think I'm that cool, but whatever. Okay, everybody put your fingers on it. I'm a big girl, I can do this. Guys, I'm scared. Okay, now we ask questions. Is there a ghost here? It says yes. Wait. JJ, you pushed it. No, I didn't. Wait, like maybe I did. Okay, ghost, what is your name? M. A. R. K. The ghost name's Mark. My uncle? Your uncle? My ex-boyfriend? Is he okay? Did he die? JJ, this is not funny. Stop messing with us. I promise I'm not doing anything. You guys are so stupid. Nate! Get the fuck out of here! I'm telling mom you said a bad word. Mom! What is going on in here? Nate is bothering me and my friends, and he pretended to kill JJ's uncle. Wait, so my uncle's okay? I literally thought my ex-boyfriend died. <laughs> he didn't die. Who might also be JJ's uncle, so that was not cool. Mom, it's no fair. I just want to play with them. What the fuck is wrong with you? You're a mean little boy. Nate! Go to your room right now. I told you to stay in there unless there was an emergency. I am sick of your shit. Fine. You had me thinking my uncle died. Do you have any donuts? Hey, JJ, you're kind of hot. Ew. I'm gay. Me too. Like you kiss girls? Yeah. Now. Wow. Guys, I'm so sorry. That was very traumatic. I understand if you are upset right now. Are you, like, gonna be okay to go to school tomorrow? Yeah, I'll be fine. This is definitely going to come up in therapy on Thursday. Yeah, same. You girls better not have any drugs or alcohol in here. I would never. What kind of sleepover is this? Lights out in 10 minutes. You guys do drugs and alcohol? Who do you think we are? We don't do drugs. Just alcohol. Oh.
drugs are for losers everybody knows that jj i mean my mom does drugs so i really try not to judge because she's a good person sometimes we don't have any money for food because she spends it all on drugs oh my god girls don't worry about that <laughs> okay do you want to step okay i'm scared don't be like scared you want to be cool though right she's already cool cassie i think i'm drunk i'm like always drunk are we gonna cuddle no oh no it's fine i guess i'll just fucking sleep on the floor this is a pretty fun sleepover i guess can i at least have a pillow i must shut up thanks okay good night i didn't bring a blanket that's your own problem emma fuck you good night guys <laughs> what's funny <laughs> nothing <laughs> guys i literally have a really important math test in the morning can you please be quiet <laughs> if i don't get at least a c minus on this math test i'm going to fail wait you actually like try <laughs> okay guys for real we need to actually try to sleep now okay okay thank you one two three Oh my god. Nothing's even funny. <laughs> I'm literally gonna fill my math test. Get the cow with a little horse. Get the cow with the cow. Get the cow with the cow. Who's that? Nothing. Why is it shot, bitches? No. Cut to do to do. The cow says moo. It is too early for that, JJ. I literally didn't sleep all night because Cassie kept farting and it literally kept waking me up. Ew. I literally did not. Is that true? There's literally no way that I'm going to pass this math test. Yeah, that's definitely why you're not going to pass it. Did you try to Dutch oven me? I literally don't fart. It's not. It doesn't happen for me. That's so silly. I don't know what you smell, but it wasn't me. The only thing getting passed in here is Cassie's gas. Literally, fuck you. Oh my god, don't say that word. You literally smell so bad. That's a bad word, and I'm trying to go to heaven. That's a bad word, and I'm trying to go to heaven. Yeah, it's too late for me. Oh my god. I already made out with too many boys before marriage. And girls. <coughs> so, are you like really experienced? Yeah, you could say that. Okay, lovebirds, can you shut up? It's time to get ready for school. Oh, no, 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 we're not lovebirds. I have a girlfriend. What? Yeah. Oh. I had no idea. I'm like thoroughly entertained right now. What's wrong? Oh, uh, nothing. I'm really happy for you. No, she's not. JJ, Emma is literally in love with you. What? Cassie, I'm literally going to fart in your face if you don't shut up. I didn't know that you like me. It's really obvious to everybody but you. Literally even the people watching this know. Girls, come on. It's time for school. Get in the car. Your brother's already in there waiting. Thank God. Thank you. Sorry my dad wouldn't let us hang out at my house. No problem. We can hang out here. Why are you whispering? Don't you think if I'm whispering, you should be too? Good point. Why are we whispering? There's a few things I should brief you on. Okay, should I take notes? No, that's okay. Just try to remember. Um, I have the memory of a squirrel, so I'm going to take notes if that's okay. I mean, I appreciate the effort. Okay, first, I did not tell my parents you were coming over. Let's keep it that way. Pretend I'm... Not if here. If you do find out, my dad is pretty homophobic, so just prepare yourself. I'm not gay. So you just asked me to be a girlfriend. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God, that's so exciting. I usually don't do relationships. Good for me. If my dad does find out you're here, you're just my friend. Pretend we're friends. Okay. Okay, lastly, my parents hate each other and are in the process of getting a divorce. So, if you hear blood curling screams or furniture breaking, that's just another day in the Johnson household. Blood curling screams and furniture breaking. It's normal. Okay, that's about it. Okay. Let's quietly sneak to my bedroom. Okay, I'll take my heels off so I don't make noise. Yeah, good idea. <laughs> okay, let's be quiet now. You're supposed to already be quiet. But I think the co 
boost, Clea. Come on. College football. College football. Super Football Saturday. JJ, is that you? Super Football Saturday. JJ, is that you? Shit. Hey, Dad. Yep. Just me and nobody else, like usual, because I have no friends. Obviously. What are you doing? Are you just getting home from school? Yes. I stayed late to tutor the dumb kids for extra credit. Why couldn't I have a cool kid? <laughs> okay, well, I'm gonna go to my room. I have a really big test tomorrow and I have to study like the non-cool kids do. Come on over here for a minute. I really, I really should be going. <laughs> you got someone waiting for you in your room? No. That was a rhetorical question. I know you have no friends. Come sit. But Come spend some quality time with your father before I grow old and die. Okay. What did you want to talk to me about? Okay. I know that this might be difficult to hear, but I think it's time that we tell you the truth. Okay. I know that this might be difficult to hear, but I think it's time that we tell you the truth. Okay. Me and your mother are getting a divorce. I know. How'd you, how'd you know? You've been sleeping on the couch every single night and you cheated on her multiple times. Oh, okay. Well, that was easier than I thought. Okay, I'm gonna go to my room now. Good night. Study hard. Zoe. Zoe. Zoe, where are you? You don't have to hide. Where the heck is she? Zoe. What are you doing in here? I told you we were going to my bedroom. I didn't know which door your bedroom was. Oh, good point. Why did you let me lead the way and then ditch me? I'm sorry, my dad woke up and started talking to me about their divorce. I was so scared and lost. I'm so sorry. I should have known that your small little boy couldn't have figured that out for yourself. Come on, let's actually go to my room now. Thank God. So, what do you want to do? What do you want to do? I don't know. I'm so happy we're finally alone and have some privacy. Me too. I've been fantasizing about this every night. <sighs> That's so hot. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh shit. Go, go. Hey. Mayo? What are you doing home from college? Winter break. What were you doing? Nothing? What were you doing? Nothing? Were you touching yourself? What? No! JJ, if you're gonna touch yourself, you should really lock your door. I wasn't touching myself! And you should really knock before you come into someone's room. Well, if someone's touching themselves, they usually lock the door. I wasn't touching myself! Okay, good, because I want to hang out. Since when do you want to hang out with me? You don't like me. JJ, I love you. You're my little sister. Wow. College has really changed you. Yeah, it really has. I realized recently that I need to start appreciating the people close to me. I'm a much nicer person now. Well, I'm not. Get out of my womb. JJ, I haven't seen you in months. So? Can you leave? No, not unless you give me one good reason. I was... I was touching myself. Oh, oh God. Ew. Please lock the door. Noted. Bye. Sorry. Were you actually like... No. I just said that so she'd leave. Oh, that's a shame. I was going to offer to step in. Oh. I should probably get up now. Do you want to? Yes. But I'm not ready. Oh, right. It would be your first time. Yeah. That's okay. We can wait until you're ready. Thanks. Zoe, so, I'm not going to be late today. Oh, okay. Um... What do you want to do? Want to hard watch our relationship on Instagram? Oh my god, should we? 
Literally nobody knows yet except us. Casey is going to kill us. Don't your parents too? I thought they were homophobic. Just my dad is, but I have my whole family blocked. What about your dad? Also homophobic and also blocked. Swag. Okay then, Casey. She's gonna find out sooner or later. Hell's gonna freeze over. Better get out coach then. Fuck it, let's do it. Okay, let's take a couple of selfie. What should we caption it? Hmm. Um. Oh, how about my elastic won't be the only thing pulling my hair anymore? Wow, we're really going for it, huh? You're actually gonna do it. Wicket. Go hard or go home, White. I definitely won't be going home then. Okay, Zoe's elastic won't be the only thing pulling her hair anymore. Post. Done. Okay, open the floodgates. I'm scared. I can't look right now. I just want to enjoy my night with you. I'm going to turn it off. Want to watch a movie and snuggle? I'd love to. Crap, I really have to pee. Okay, quiet, Zoe. You can do this. Oh, it's so cold down here. I guess poor people don't have heat. Quiet, Zoe. Quiet, Zoe. No, you're here. JJ? Is that you? What are you doing up so late? Um, I just have to pee. The, the, ba the bathroom's not this way. Oh, wait, I forgot. What? Okay, good night. H hey. Yeah? Um, after your mother and I g get divorced, do you want to... Um, do you want to come live with me? Yeah, sure, Dad. Really? Um, yes. That's, that's great. Shit. Oh, by the way, after your mother and I g get divorced, do you want to, do you want to come live with me? Yeah, sure, Dad. Really? Um, yes. That's, that's great. Shit. Oh, by the way, um, I have a boy that I want to introduce you to. I know you think you're gay, but that's just a phase. Okay, sure. I I love boys. Lo that was easy. Okay, you can meet him tomorrow. Oh, okay. Good night. Bathroom's the other way. Right. I mean, what? Hey. Where did you go? Bathroom. Did you wake my dad up? Yes. Good news and bad news. And, and badder news. What's the good news? He totally thought that I was you. What's the bad news? You're going on a date with a boy tomorrow. What? What's the badder news? Um, I agreed to living with him after the divorce. Awesome. I'm going back to sleep. Snuggle me and be cute so I can forget how dumb you are. Okay. Now it is very important that this date goes well. Why? Because you need to convert. To Christianity? No, to heterosexuality. Uh why is it okay for you to cheat on mom and sleep with multiple women at the same time, but it's not okay for me to love one singular woman? Because men get to do whatever they want. This is how the world runs. Get used to it. And what if the day doesn't go well? Camp. Oh, wait, that sounds pretty fun. Like, with swimming and crafts and stuff? Conversion, camp. All summer long. If I can't convert you, they can. But it's very expensive and I don't want to pay for it. But sometimes they have scholarship programs if I can prove that you're an above and beyond homo. You'd probably get it. I don't want to go to conversion camp. Then this date better go well. How do you even know this boy? Um, he's one of my, my friend's kids. I don't know much about him, but he's a boy and that'll do for me. By friend? You mean bimbo? Are you sure he's not your kid too? Yes. I'm like 60% sure. So potentially dating my biological brother and cheating on people is still Better than me being gay. Hmm, got it. Makes a lot of sense. That is enough of your attitude. I'll pick you up in a few hours. Act straight. Are you sure he's not your kid too? Yes. I'm like 60% sure. So potentially dating my biological brother and cheating on people is still 
better than me being gay. Hmm, got it. Makes a lot of sense. That is enough of your attitude. I'll pick you up in a few hours. Act straight. Wow, your dad is actually worse than mine. Oh, Zoe, I can't do this. I'm a waging lesbian. I don't even know how to go on a date with a boy, never mind pretend I'm actually into them. Baby, you've got this. I've been on so many dates with boys. I'm going to be a couple booths down, and I'm going to be in your ear the whole time telling you what to say. You're going to be fine. Okay. Maybe I'll get lucky and he won't show up. How long have we been waiting? Hello? Zoe? Hello? Can you hear me? JJ? Oh my god, hi! I didn't realize I called you. What? I'm in a restaurant. I, I know, I'm right behind you. Did you forget about the plan? Did you forget about the plan? The plan? The plan. Plan. Plan? Oh my god. Plan B? Was I supposed to take it? Oh my god, has it been more than 72 hours? No, Zoe. Remember, my dad is making me go on a date with a boy and you're supposed to help me. Oh, yeah. I was wondering why I was sitting here alone. I don't do that. I'm not a loser. I ate lunch every day alone before I had friends. And that's so good for the mind and soul. Incoming. I think this is him. Stay focused. I need you. Hello. You must be JJ. It's a pleasure to meet you. You are much more gorgeous than I anticipated. Sorry, I don't know what you're talking about. You must have the wrong girl. Trust. I apologize for the bother. Maybe you're looking for that girl down there. She's sitting alone and looks like she's waiting for someone. All right. Good heavens. That is a bit of a downgrade. I think we look a lot alike, actually. Not even a little bit. You are much more attractive. But girls don't typically want to date me, so I will accept what I can. You are much more attractive. But girls don't typically want to date me, so I will accept what I can. Okay, bye. Pretty warning, this guy is a total douche, but like also such a loser. Very weird combination. Oh, quite. Hello, you must be JJ. It is a pleasure to meet you. You are very average looking. Thanks. Are you going to ask me my name or do you not care? Ask his name. No kidding. What's your name? Ebenezer Muriel Malarkey. But you can call me by my first name. Ebenezer. Yeah, that's so much better. Tell him you like his name. I like your name. Thank you. Would you like to hear the origin of it? No. Yes, you do. I mean, no way I don't. Wonderful. So my last name, of course, was passed down many generations from my Irish ancestors. According to the Oxford Dictionary, it also means meaningless or nonsense. But that definition does not accurately depict my character. So my last name, of course, was passed down many generations from my Irish ancestors. According to the Oxford Dictionary, it also means meaningless or nonsense. But that definition does not accurately depict my character. Are you sure? Be nicer. I know he's a loser, but just tap into your acting skills, JJ. I mean, are you sure? I, I can't imagine someone as splendid as you could have a name with such a negative definition. Thank you. I don't let it define me. As for my middle name, Muriel, I was named after my great aunt, Muriel, who served our country. She was in the military? No, she was a traveling lunch lady. She served our country. Wait, what a lovely lady to be named after. I think so. Seem more interested. Ask him the origin of his first name. So what about Ebenezer? With such a bold name like that, it must have an interesting origin story. No, my parents just liked the name. I can't imagine why. <coughs> not, I, I can't imagine why not. Nor can I. Ask him the origin of his first name. So what, what about Ebenezer? With such a bold name like that it must have an interesting origin story no my parents just liked the name i can't imagine why <coughs> not I, I can't imagine why not nor can i shall we investigate the menu wow he's really not gonna ask you about your name i hate boys tell him about your name anyway do you want to hear the origin of my name it would be impolite if i said no okay i'm gonna i'm gonna take that as a guess so, um, my name is JJ Johnson, and, um, JJ actually stands for Johnson & Johnson, the family company, and, um, one of the creators of the COVID vaccine. So, um, my full name is Johnson & Johnson Johnson. That's a dreadfully terrible name. Thanks.
My parents aren't very creative. I would like to supply my body of some nourishment now. I would like to supply my body of some nourishment now. Okay. Okay, now let him order for you. It makes them feel manly. Can you order for me? Oh, certainly. I apologize. I did not acquire that you were incapable of reading. I can read. I am befuddled why you would desire me to order for you then. Um... Chivalry. Chivalry. I am a feminist. God damn, I'm gonna be helpless here. Please do your best, I am so lost. Fear not, I will do my best. Huh? I will order you something that I suspect would be adequate. Okay. What do you like to do for fun? What do you like to do for fun? Well... Yeah, this girl's been talking to herself for like 30 minutes. That sounds awful. I think she's schizophrenic. Okay, where do you go to school? She like really believes someone's in the booth across from her. Oh, I hate that school. My ex goes there. Yeah, the customers are starting to get worried. All right, I'll, I'll go talk to her. Hello, miss. Can I get you anything? No! Oh, sorry. Yeah, the customers are starting to get worried. What do you like to do for fun? All right, I'll, I'll go talk to her. Hello, miss. Can I get you anything? No! Oh, sorry. You're ordering me a house salad with no dressing. It appears to me that you are trying to lose weight. No. My mistake. A house salad with no dressing? Okay, one house salad with no dressing. What? No! No! No, no what? You want a double cheeseburger. I want a double cheeseburger. Um, uh, no, I don't want a double cheeseburger, but I'll get you a double cheeseburger. I don't want a double cheeseburger. I, I don't want a double cheeseburger. Okay, what do you want? What do I want? What do I want? I believe that is what we are trying to figure out. What do you want? Sorry, I'm not talking to you. I'm not talking to you. I have a feeling. What? Do you, do you see someone there? What? <sighs> You're talking to a friend, aren't you? Yeah, how did, how did you know? My mother had schizophrenia. I'm sorry to hear that, but what does that have to do with me? You're talking to a friend, aren't you? Yeah, how did, how did you know? <sighs> My mother had schizophrenia. I'm sorry to hear that, but what does that have to do with me? Oh, honey, we need to get you some help. With what? Just come with me, I'm gonna help you. No, I can't leave my friend. Honey, your friend isn't real. It's okay, you can leave them. My friend is real, she's sitting right there. Sweetheart, nobody can see her except you. Come on. Are you enjoying your meal? Zoe, am I enjoying my meal? Zoe, are you there? What, what was the question? Are you enjoying your meal? Um, no. Drought, I apologize. Would you like something else? I mean, no, I like it. It's... It could. Splendid. Oh, I believe your father is arriving to pick you up in just a few moments. It could. Splendid. Oh, I believe your father is arriving to pick you up in just a few moments. How do you know that? He arranged this date, after all. What? I just... I didn't realize you two were so close. Are we all set over here? Indeed. Um, excuse me? Um, what happened to the girl that was in that table over there? Poor thing was yelling to herself all evening. I'm very familiar with schizophrenia, don't worry, I took her to get some help. What? Okay, so will that be one check or two? One. Two. I believe in building up and encouraging young women to be strong and financially independent. I would prefer if you paid for your own meal. I guess two. Right. So, um, are you going to tell my dad that this date went well? I suppose it was splendid. I would take great pleasure in seeing you once again. Perhaps next time we can try fornication. Dad! Where have you been? I was taking the trash out. At 3 a.m.? Yep. Sit. You know your curfew is 8 p.m. I'm 16. I should be able to do what I want. Congratulations, I'm 35. And you will do as I say, or you will not live here. Now you're going to disrespect me by being on your phone. Doing that damn thing. Dad, what the fuck? Deep breaths, Bobby, deep breaths. Where were you at 3 a.m.? A boy's house. <laughs> you wish. What is that supposed to mean? Mm -hmm. You know what? 
You're grounded. And as punishment, you will spend the weekend Christmas shopping with me and your mother. I'll be right back. Sit your ass down. Why do you seem so anxious? Is there something you want to tell me? No. Sorry, baby. I was trying to find a backpack. Plus, we're going to do homework. Maybe we can study tomorrow. Hello? Congratulations! You've been selected to win a free cruise to the Bahamas. Oh my god. And like most cruises, all the expenses are included. Are you serious? All we would like for you to do is to participate in a short survey. If you'd like to proceed, press 1. If not, press 1. Yeah, I'll do a survey. You pressed 1. You're on your way to winning a free cruise to the Bahamas. I thought I already won. First question. Please provide your full name and address. Okay, um, my full name is Heidi. Elizabeth Smith. And my address is 267 Roast Meat mm -hmm. Hill Drive in Beverly Hills, California. Okay, thank you. Now, could you please tell me your mother's maiden name? Well, that's an odd question. Um, you know what? I um I actually don't know. Let me bring my mom and I'll um I'll let you know. Just hold on one sec, okay? Okay. Mom? Hi, Dave. Where are you? I've been done with my colonoscopy for five hours to take okay, uh, yeah. to oh, pick okay. me up. I'm actually in the car right now driving to come get you. Um, could you just tell me what your maiden name is real quick? Parker. Okay, thanks, Mom. I'll see you on Sunday for dinner. No, Heidi, I need you to pick me up. God damn it! Hi, you still there? Yeah, um, it's Parker. Okay, great. Now, what is the name of your first pet? I don't really have any pets growing up. Kaisei! What? Yeah, um, what was the name of that hamster I bought you when you were three? The one that died because you forgot to give it water? Yeah. His name was Hampy. Okay. Um, yeah, it was Hampy. Hampy the hamster. Excellent! You almost won your free cruise. Kaisei, we're gonna go on a cruise. Oh my god, really? Yeah, I just have to win on this survey. How do you win on a survey? Lastly, please provide your social security number. Okay, it's, um, one, two, three, four, five, three, your social security number. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. That's mine. Okay, perfect. Let me just run this real quick. Congratulations, you have won! Please arrive at the dock at 2 p.m. I will text you the address right now. What? What? 2, 2 p.m. is in 43 minutes. That is correct. Have a great vacation, Mrs. Smith. Oh, it's actually Miss Smith. I'm divorced. Hello? Okay, Casey, pack your bags. We're going to the Bahamas, bitch. USA! 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 JJ, why are you not wearing red, white, and blue? I'm wearing black for the funeral. Funeral? Oh no, did Auntie Karen finally kick the bucket? Unfortunately, no. Oh, thank God, I forgot to make sure we're in her will. I'm wearing black for the funeral of our independence. For the women, for the gay people, for the trans people, for the black people, for the indigenous people, everybody except white straight men. We are going to your uncle's barbecue in 30 minutes, and I still need to go to the liquor store and pick up alcohol. It's BYOBG. Bring your own booze and guns. Get your stuff in some colors, right now. You want colors? Okay, fine. These are the only colors I will be wearing today, and I am not going. Huh. You're going. You think you can tell me what to do because you're a straight white man, don't you? Yes. I am not going to stand for this. You're right, you're sitting. Both v. Way was overturned, and who knows what's next? Probably gay marriage. You don't need to worry about getting an abortion. You're gay. And your ways are young to be having sex. Are you fucking serious right now? That is not the fucking point. Got it up to here. I would not be celebrating love for this country. JJ, you got it all wrong, dear. It's not love for the country. It's love for alcohol. I love alcohol too. I'm not celebrating. I'm mourning. Wait, what? What? Who is giving you alcohol? Oh, okay. huh. Listen, do you hear that? We have to get going. People are already starting the fireworks. Or gunshots. Well, either way, I want to go. Ah, oh, shit. The liquor store isn't even open today. That's it. I'm not going anymore. I'm so happy you decided to make the correct decision. W wait, do you have any alcohol in here? Anywhere that I could, um, borrow? Are you joking? Hello? Wait, slow down. What? Oh my god. Okay, okay. thanks for letting me know. So, um, it turns out your Uncle Karen actually did die. Just right now. Oh, well. What? What is this? Uh, I was, um, napping. <sighs> Unbelievable.
I saw a spider in my room, so. <sighs> okay. Clearly, we need to go over the basics first. This is a car. And the purpose of this vehicle is to get you from point A to point B. Mm -hmm. That is it. It is not to be used for napping or any recreational activities, including, but not limited to, hanging out with friends, kissing boys or girls. Just girls. Having sex with boys or girls. <sighs> Smoking weed or any other drugs. Anything that will bring you joy, that is not what this is for. Do you understand? I can use it to go get the drugs though, right? You are this close to living with your Aunt Linda. I'm kidding. Hey, nice to meet you. Hey, yeah, thanks for coming out. So, what's up? Um, I don't know, just like a long day at work. Oh, uh, yeah, I feel. What do you do for work? I'm like in between jobs right now. Oh, cool. So like, what are you looking for? I mean, like, what were you looking for on Bumble? Was it Bumble? Fuck, I totally thought we matched on Tinder. No, I actually don't have Tinder. Oh. Oh, no, it was that other girl I met up with last night. Oh. So like, do you do this often? Yes. Oh. You? No, this is actually my first time meeting up with someone from a dating app. But it's grown great, so. So, um, just so you know, I'm like pretty emotionally unavailable right now because of my girlfriend. I mean, my ex-girlfriend recently broke up with me. So yeah, it's been rough. Oh, I'm so sorry. How long ago was the breakup? Like two years ago, but you know, it's, it's still like rough. Yeah, I get it. Do you? You're pretty hot. You should definitely, like, be my girl. Without, like, the officialness, you know? Because, like, I'm not ready for that yet. And, I mean, honestly, I'm probably not going to be ever, so. Okay. But, like, are you still going to talk to other people? Um, I'm probably not. So you probably shouldn't because I'm not. But, like, if I do, you can't get mad at me because, like, we're not official. Mm hmm Yeah. I'm just, like, really emotionally unavailable right now. So, like, I really don't want to hold you down. But, like, I'm probably not going to talk to other people. So... You probably shouldn't either. Okay, do you think like down the road you'll be open to like a real relationship? Probably not. Okay, yeah, I don't know if this is gonna work. But, do you still wanna hook up though? No. But. One week later. One second. Hello? Hey, um, this is Emily from Bumble. I feel really bad about the way we left things and I was wondering if you wanted to go on another date maybe? Oh, uh, I'm so sorry, dude. I actually have a girlfriend now and we're so in love. We're actually moving in together tomorrow. What? Okay, have a nice life. What the fuck? I really like this girl named Emma, but I don't know how to tell her and get her attention. I feel the same way about your brother. I hate everybody. Do you guys want to play unicorns? No. Wait, I know what we can do. I saw this really cool app that you can make your own music videos. What if we make some and then post them so Emma and your brother can see how cool we are and they'll want to date us? Okay, I like this idea. Okay, it's called the Tempo app. Okay. Which one should I do? They have one that says love. I'm not ready to say I love you just yet though, so... This is perfect. I'm gonna do this one. Okay, all I have to do is just upload like 10 pictures of myself. That's it. Okay, ready? Let's see. Okay, show me. This is perfect. Okay, wait, that's actually kind of dope. Okay, I'm gonna send it to her now. Okay, now we wait. Who texted me? <gasps> she sent one back. I was dead and you were my baby. Wow. She really photoshopped us together. Okay, I'm in love. I've decided I'm in love. Okay, now it's my turn. Can you guys help me take some cute pictures? Okay, if you say so. Okay, do something funny. Okay. JJ, you gotta seem cooler than that. How do I look cooler? I'm already cool. Why am I friends with who? 
Can we do an action shot of me doing a jump? Please? Okay. Okay. How's that? Looks good. <laughs> Pretty. Okay, why don't you do some like cooler poses? Maybe something a little more subtle? Yeah, that's better. Cute. Looking good, bestie. Maybe not the Hey Mamas. Nobody, nobody likes that. I'm a Hey Mamas. You're right. I get plenty of girls. You look great. If I was gay, I would totally date you. Can I get two girls anything? Maybe some condoms, some cigarettes? We're gay. Dental dams? No, mom. Go hang out with your own friends. But I don't have any friends. I've burned a lot of bridges. Any friends I've had, I've either slept with their husbands and or wives. Go make some new ones then. How? This is awkward. Go download Lex. It's an 18 plus queer app to make friends or find dates. Okay, leave us alone. Okay, let's see what this thing's about. Two pretty and bored girls. My roommate and I really want to do something fun, but chill tonight thinking about a game night. Someone entertain us. Entertain you, huh? In what way? Am I supposed to interpret that as sexual? Because I definitely did. Oh, I can just click on their profile. Oh, oh, she's pretty. Okay, I can just message her? Oh, perfect. This is easy. Take that. I'm gonna have friends in no time. I don't need you. Where are the little bottoms that want attention? I would I would think of myself as a top. No, I'm definitely I'm definitely a top. Yeah, you know what? I'm definitely not. I'm gonna message her. You know what? Maybe I should just make my own post. Seeking queer friends. I'm very lonely. My daughter no longer wants to hang out with me. I'm very friendly. Just don't let me near your significant other. Perfect. This is fun. I'm gonna have so many new friends. Hey, Emma, do you wanna be my New Year's kiss? Oh my God, yeah. I'm losing my girl to someone way hotter than me. I don't think she's hotter than you. Oh my God, don't look. I said don't look. When someone says don't look, it kind of makes you want to look. What am I looking at? My ex-girlfriend is over there. Casey? Isn't she a bitch? Yes, but she was my bitch. Why don't you want her to see you? Because she hates me ever since I broke up with her. Well, she sees you and she's walking this way. Shit. Hey, JJ, how have you been? Good. I'm good, too. Thanks for asking. So, do you have a kiss for midnight? Yep. Call us. What? Oh, that's too bad. I was gonna say if you wanted to be mine. We never did get to have our first kiss. You really wanna kiss me? <laughs> You're so funny. Wait, kissing my ex? That would totally make Emma jealous. Casey, wait! Yeah, I'll kiss you. Okay, great. Can't wait. Your lips are so kissable. Which ones? All the girls here are gay, bro. Who am I supposed to kiss? They should like the mic. I guess I'll just kiss a boy, and if I have to, whatever. You ready? Ready. I guess I'll just kiss myself, per usual. I can't watch this. Five, four, three, two, one. Happy New Year! Woo! <coughs> Loser? What the flick? That's what you get for breaking up with me. Men. Hey guys, what are you doing here? I'm subbing your class today because your teacher is sick and is currently projectile vomiting and we have some budget cuts so we can't afford a real substitute. Yes! That's cool. Yay! This is the best day ever. Let's start with a fun lesson. Things that people should be fined for. Go. Bullying. Ooh, dentists that try to have conversations with you while they have their tools in your mouth. Oh, I hate that. People who drive slow in a left lane. Um, parents that don't let you stay home when you're sick. <coughs> That's literally so gross. <coughs> Please go to the nurse's office. Up. Oh. Okay. Anyone else? Oh, oil and gas companies responsible for high methane emissions. Actually, the new Inflation Reduction Act just did that. Really? Yeah. Companies that emit more than 25,000 metric tons of methane will now be fine. Why is that a good thing? Global warming, duh. Yeah, methane warms the planet 80 times more than carbon dioxide over the period of 20 years. So scientists have said that reducing methane emissions is actually one of our best chances at reducing global warming and climate impacts. Cool. Did you hear that? Hi, my name is Michaela. Welcome to Olive Garden. I'm going to be taking care of you today. What can I get started for you on this beautiful Sunday evening? 
Hi, my name is Michaela. Welcome to Olive Garden. I'm going to be taking care of you. What can I get started for you? All water is cool. Okay. I'm so sorry, sir. Did you want chicken or steak? Oh, you want pasta. I'm so sorry. Hi, my name is Michaela. Wow, I love that shirt. It looks really great on you. What can I get for you today, beautiful? Hi, I just wanted to check in and make sure you were happy with your waters. Good, okay. Still doing good with those waters? Oh, okay. I know you didn't ask for one, but I saw you were missing a few sips, so I brought you a new one. Did you want me to run a card for you? Hi, my name's Michaela. What can I get for you today? I brought a bunch of fun games for us to play. We can stay up all night playing them. I'm so excited. Oh my God. Guys, I can fit one other person in my bed with me. Does anyone want to sleep in the bed with me? Uh, yeah, dibs. Uh, I'm not sleeping on the floor. If you make me sleep on the floor, I'm going home. So I'm sleeping right here. Uh, just so you guys know, I have to leave by midnight at the latest because I have to be up for work early tomorrow. So. <laughs> can you shut the fuck up? We're trying to sleep. Sorry. <laughs> Uh, do you have an extra pillow and blanket? I didn't realize I was supposed to bring one. No, sorry. I miss you, baby. Yeah. I want to come home and miss you. Hey, hey, do you want to cuddle? We can just, like, spoon each other. Dude, dude, get up. It's 2 o'clock. Leave me alone. Okay, everything that comes into this house needs to be washed. Like, thoroughly washed with antibacterial soap. I didn't see you wash your hands. It wasn't 20 seconds. Did you sing happy birthday? We're washing each egg individually. Okay, this is clean. I don't want to contaminate it with the dirty one. Stop touching everything! Did you wash your hands? What time is it? Oh, it's 3 p.m. Well, I don't have anything to do today anyway. I can't leave that place, so I'm going back to sleep. Starbucks is closed indefinitely. <laughs> I'm so excited to party tonight. Oh my god, we're gonna get so fucked up. No, I can't come over. We're not supposed to leave the house. You're the reason that this is continuing to spread. You do realize that, right? Good morning, students. My name is Mrs. Albuquerque. I will be your teacher for Algebra 2 this year. Do not call me by my first name or you will get sent to the office. I know your teachers may have put up with your shit in 11th grade, but in 12th grade, you are here to learn. Oh, hi guys, how you doing? I'm sorry, I missed my- Hey guys, good morning. I'm sorry I'm late. I'm pretty hungover. What are we doing? And he told me that he didn't want to be with me anymore because I was too clingy. Like, okay, so for tonight's assignment, you will do pages six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I don't really feel like teaching, so we're just gonna have like a private study on your own day. So just do six, forty-seven, forty-eight, and forty-nine, and then you may stop at fifty. Didn't do anything wrong, baby. <laughs> Any of you see the game last night? I know, wasn't it so good? Oh my god! You know what? Class is dismissed. Okay, just just go home. Okay, I totally got this. I got this. Holy shit, how many freaking pages are there? Oh, oh my god, I really should have studied. Why did I not study? I've like never done homework in this class and now, now it's gonna show. Okay, I got 52. And that's not even an option. Oh god. Why the hell do I even need to know how to do this anyway? This is never going to apply to anything in real life. That girl is so hot. I want her to pin me against the wall and... What if someone in here can read my mind? They would know every dirty thought I'm having. Oh my God, they're gonna know I'm gay. They're gonna know I'm gay, oh God. He's totally staring at me. He's probably jerking himself off under his desk right now. He knows every gay thought I'm having right now. What am I even saying? People can't read other people's minds, that's, that's crazy. But just in case they can, I'm, I'm gonna just not think of dirty thoughts. Okay, I, I gotta focus on this fucking test. She's already done? Are you kidding me? I'm not even done with the first question. Hey babe, I'm gonna go out for a bit. No, you're not. You're staying home. Why? I swear to God, if you leave this house, we're done. Please? Stop being ridiculous and just go take a shower. 
Hey babe, I'm going out. Okay babe, have a good time, I love you. You don't wanna know where I'm going? No, of course not, I trust you. I'll see you later. I'm going out. Oh, okay. Are you okay? Yeah, no, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Okay, bye. Do you like them more than me? Yeah, I do, honestly. <laughs> Where the hell are you? You were supposed to be home three minutes ago. Thank God I can still track his location. Mom, 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 look at me. Mom, look, I can, look, mom, mom, mom. Look, I can hold my breath underwater. <gasps> mom, you weren't even looking, mom. I'm a mermaid. This jet feels nice. Ooh. Mommy, I think I peed in the pool. Okay, I'm gonna go underwater and I'm gonna say something. You have to guess what I'm saying. Okay, one, two, three. <gasps> Did you say pineapple? <laughs> Look, I have boobies. Haha. Uh -huh. Hey, babe, where do you wanna eat? I don't care, you can pick. Okay, how about McDonald's? Ew, I don't eat fast food. Okay, how about Chick-fil-A? Chick-fil-A is homophobic. Okay, well, where do you want to eat? I don't care, whatever you want. Okay, what about a steakhouse? You know I'm a vegetarian, the only thing I can eat there is salad. Do you want me to eat salad? Will you have a nice meal? Okay, how about Italian? Do you want Italian? Why, so I can eat all the carbs and then you can leave me because I'm fat? Okay, how about Chinese food? Do you want Chinese food? You know how much I hate Chinese food. So what do you want? I said I don't care. Okay, you can make this for yourself. Hi, yes, uh, I'm sorry. The models are actually down the hall. Actually, I'm here about the assistant job. Really? Okay, well then. All right, we'll just have a seat there. Um, so what's, what is, what's your name? Tag Jones. Uh-huh, go on. That's it. That's my whole name. That's your whole name. Okay, of course it is. Okay, well, let's, let's just have a look-see here. I know I haven't worked in an office before, and I really don't have a lot of experience. Oh, come but on I... now, what are you talking about? You've got three years painting houses? <laughs> Two whole summers at TGI Fridays? It's lame, I know. But I'm a goal-oriented person, very eager to learn. Okay, just hold on a second. Sorry, it's for human resources. Everybody has to do it. Would you just stand up, please? <laughs> I'm assigning you all a book to read. A book? God, I hate those. Now, kids, this book is very controversial and has just been taken off the banned books list. Oh, really? Sweet. It's called Catcher in the Rye, and it has some very risque parts. All right. And strong, vulgar language. And in fact, many schools across the country still ban this book because it's thought to be so inappropriate. Oh man, I can't wait! Tonight I want you to read chapters one through five, and tomorrow we'll discuss the- No, no, come on, let's read it now! Mr. Garrison, didn't the guy who shot John Lennon say it was because of this book? Uh, yes, apparently John Lennon's killer said he was inspired by Catcher in the Rye, but he was just a kook. Whoa, you're telling us this book is filthy, inappropriate, and made a guy shoot the king of hippies? Can we please read this right now? You will read it at home, and you will all be mature about its adult themes and language. Aww. Hi, yeah, um, I was wondering when I can go home. You can't. Okay, well, do you think this is gonna be wrapped up around like five o'clock? Because I have a date at six. You're being kidnapped. What exactly do you mean, kidnapped? I'm not a kid. Do I look like a kid? I'm a full grown woman. You cannot leave. Uh-huh, I see. Okay, well, um, this needs to be done by tomorrow morning at the latest. Yeah, uh, uh that's, that's not gonna happen. You know what? I I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go. You can't leave. Okay, well, I'll just call the cops then. I took your phone. Oh, what? I have another phone. Duh. What? Why? <clears throat> Kelsey! What? What? Open your textbook. Why? Because I said so. No, I don't, 
I don't want to. This is very important. Stacy, do you think this is gonna be useful in the future? Cause, cause I don't. When am I ever going to need to know the quadratic formula in real life? How about instead you teach us something like useful, like what taxes are or like how to buy a house or a car or what credit is. Maybe something we can actually use. Look, I'm just trying to do my job, okay? I, I, think, I'm, I think I'm just gonna go. No. Come on, Stacy, let's blow this popsicle stand. Are, are you okay? Yeah, I just need a second. What are you doing? The blood moves faster this way. Oh god. Ow. My iron. Hi, welcome to Lush. What brings you in today? Uh, I'm, I'm just looking. Thanks. Do you have a saggy tush? Because you can firm it up with rump. Just rub it on your rump. I don't think so. Come here, bend over. Take your pants off. I'll, I'll, I'll give you a free sample. Yeah, no, I'm gonna pass. Not your thing? Okay, okay, no problem. What about some shampoo? Hello, shampoo? I mean, not to be rude, but it looks like you could use it. <laughs> you know, I think I'm just gonna look around. Not your thing, okay, I totally understand. Okay, what about this? You can try this nice soap. You know what, I think I'm all set. Put your hand in the bowl! <laughs> okay. Soft, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, so soft, so soft. Okay, excuse me. Okay, one more. Oh, oh, one more, one more, just this. Oh, oh, and this. Um, oh, crap, my audio equipment. Hi. Is this normal? Oh, is the plane malfunctioning? What's happening? Excuse me! Please, fasten your seatbelt. We are experiencing some turbulence. Ladies and gentlemen, we have about three hours to go. So one time I was in Croatia and they had these little ant- mm -hmm. Um, Yeah, cool. Fast forward 10 years and I'm still there. Can you just shut up? Earth are you wearing? 